Dubai. And we are live! Hello guys, and welcome back to another cold stream. On today's stream, as you can tell by the title and the thumbnail, we are going to be playing uh, some Adam Emancipator as well as some Dragon Link, because both of these decks have gotten quite a big boost off of the new adventure stuff. Um, so, yeah. 60 card, Dragon Link, shenanigans, ensue. Uh, yeah. Uh, yeah, first things first, though, uh, we gotta go to the shop, we gotta get the adventure package on this account, we have it on the main account, this is the second account, we gotta get the adventure stuff, what are we looking for, we're looking for two Rider of Aramisir, the one Wandering Griffin Rider, uh, oh, two Water Enchantress, and the one Fateful Adventure, and that's it, that's all we care about that's in this pack, uh, how many you are tokens do we have? Not a lot. And do I have anything that I can realistically dismantle? <sighs> um, oh, is this also where I play Plunder? Oh, I do. Oh, this will be fantastic. Um, I probably could dismantle something from like... Eh, maybe. Let's just hop into this. 20 packs, that's it. We gotta get... How many URs? Within 20 packs, this will go great, guys. I promise. So far, not looking great with the uh, with the packs. Didn't look like we got much. Um, but anyways, well, I, I, I got this. It's fine. We got this. Wham. Oh, token stampede. All tokens in attack position gain a thousand attack. Also, they cannot be destroyed by battle. I didn't know that was a card. That's hilarious. I It makes sense why it's in here, but that's also very funny. I got nothing from that. It lied to me. It said, no, the Utopia. Why are you here? You're going to ruin this pack. Oh, just kidding. Normally, he ruins it. Alright, at the very least, that's UR Dust that we can break down. It's not like we really need the SR Dust, so we'll be fine. Alright. Something adventure related. Not! That's not adventure related. I need at least 150 Dust after the fact to get all of the adventure stuff that I need. M Pen. Eaglin, cool, don't care. Not gonna use those, not gonna play Flunderies. Oh, cool, magic. You better not lie to me, Peck. You better not lie. You just leveled up. You better actually give me an SR. Okay, at least I got an SR. And pen. Okay. Sure. Sure. Whatever. Alright, give me Rite of Aramisir. Give me Rite of Aramisir. Small World's nice. I do like Small World. Three dead cards. Well, I just realized the Sorceress is wearing heels. Thank you, Jinzo, for updating the uh, the announcement page. Thank you. Oh my good gravy! Okay, that's a lot of shiny packs. Alrighty. Starting off with with the good one. All right. It showed the Utopia, so I'm probably gonna get nothing out of this. Oh. All right. Not, that's not the one that we were looking for, but okay. Okay. Yeah, 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 yeah. I mean, I'm not expecting to get, like, the entire set of adventure stuff from 20 packs, but still. We've played a lot of agents recently. Agents are cool. I haven't played them in a while, but... 
I have a playset of this stupid card. I don't want it. Leave me alone. Leave me alone. I don't want it. Ugh. Small world's nice. We always like small world. We can always use that later. If need be. It's a kind of generic card. Gosh, dang it. Yo! Adventures of... My friends were so upset that I kept summoning Christia. Yeah, Christia's fun to play against. Oh my gosh, this pack is stacked. Two Eaglin. Nice, now we have a full play set of Eaglin. Yes! Not exactly what I wanted, but we got the Wandering Griffin Rider, which is the important one. Uh, let's go. Let's go. Supernatural Danger Zone. Highway to the Danger Zone, baby. <laughs> Alright, give me another piece of the Fateful Engine, or the Adventure Engine. I will even take Fateful Adventure. Okay, uh, that's... It's fine. I just realized the event uh, is going to start up tomorrow. Which is exciting. Uh, okay, so let's go to the... Let's go to Plunders first. We're gonna add some new things to Plunders. We're gonna add the Adventure Engine. And then we're gonna take out some cards. Do 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 Okay. So now we gotta dismantle some things. Looking spicy, indeed. I wanna keep sight because it's funny. I thought it started at 5 a.m. today. Oh. I mean, it starts in like a couple of hours. It's tomorrow for me. So. I don't think it started. I don't think it started. Did it start today? I saw that it started the 18th, and it's currently the 18th. But let me check. Because I, I saw that it wasn't open. Yeah, it says coming soon. Yeah, it starts at... 10 for me at 10 p.m. my time so in like seven hours yeah there you go which basically means it starts tomorrow because i ain't playing in it today i'll tell you that i forgot to dismantle some cards because i got distracted uh we're dismantling that guy we're dismantling this one did I get any other URs to just... Oh, yep. The magic key stuff. Whoa, magic key. There's a fur hire. There's a fur hire. Don't know why I have the fur hires, but I do. Eaglin. We'll keep it just in case, because it's fine. Because it's funny. I don't really need anything. So we'll just dismantle those. I need like what one fateful adventure and then a whole bunch of UR material. Oh no. Well it's probably better to get the right of Aramisir first. Do I have anything I can dismantle? Finally taking the plunder. What? No. Dragon Link. Nope, we're building Dragon Link. I've already built Plunder. I've already played Plunder. Come on, stick with the times ascended. Do I have anything else I can dismantle? I need these for Plunder. I want to keep this because it's funny. I could probably get rid of this, but let's not... 
No, I kind of need all of these. Well, alright then. I guess let's play... I could throw in the adventure engine into my blue eyes. That'd be funny. Alright, we'll play some ritual beasts, I guess. Although I don't really want to. Maybe megaliths? I only have one called by in this deck. What the fluff? Oh, it's just Hulk stuff. Oh, cool. Oh, cool. Hulk stuff. Hmm. You know what? We'll play Adam Emancipator without adventure for right now. Going first. Although I don't know how good Adam Spader is going to be with the adventure stuff, but I have seen that some people have played it. So, I'm interested. I'm intrigued, you know? Wow, this is a terrible hand. This is a, like, phenomenal going second hand, and a terrible going first hand. Is there anything I could I could like normal dropsies go meow meow special roxies and then go into like nothing fantastic huh well let's I mean start with dropsies. Out comes Meow. Oh, cool, they have Ash. Do I just let it happen? Do I just let it get Ash? I think I do. I think I do. Alright. Dang. Happen to draw all of the non-starter cards. I mean, it's out of Emancipator. There's a lot of bricks, so sometimes it happens. Huh. Okay. Okay. I will ash that. Thanks, though. Great! That's fantastic! This Nibiru is gonna do nothing! Dude, I hate Dark Magicians. Why? Sure. Trust me, I'm not activating spells, so I don't really care. What do I need to see in Adam Emancipator? Literally, like, anyone kind of does it. Especially since I have so many bricks just gone. That's an Adam Spader. That is any Adam Spader, baby. I didn't whiff. Let's go. Ooh. I'm gonna go supplier. I think supplier is better here. Doesn't matter, because this guy's gonna search. And we're going to search for Guardian. And then let's just normal the Guardian. And now... What? Okay, my opponent has something. Oh, I think they have a Solemn Judgment. Most likely. So let's go for a... Gallant Granite with these two. Yep. It appears to be a Solemn Judgment. This guy can reveal a rock, right? Yep, fantastic. And since I already have a block, block Dragon in hand, 
this judgment doesn't really do much. It prevents me from getting to the other tuner that I wanted, but that's not that big of a deal. Let's go one, two, three. Let's keep the tuner in grave. I like Block Dragon, he's cute. <laughs> he is, he's very cute. Um, I could link off. That puts me in danger of Nibiru and other such hand traps. Yeah, it's probably still worth it though. Let's go Union Carrier. And then I can search Gigantes and then the two twos. Unless they have Ash. If they have Ash, I cry. All right, no Ash, Pog. Gigantes. Seeker. Researcher. And then we banish. Uh, keep the tuner. Summon this guy. Special Searcher. Special Seeker. And then let's go rolling again. We rolling, rolling, rolling. Okay, that's another supplier. Roxy's. Ooh, let's go Roxy's. <clears throat> Did it matter which one I went for? Not really. I didn't really see that first reveal. I wasn't paying attention. Uh, I think I whiffed. I did. It was a Seeker, Triple Maxi, and an Imperm. Wow. Am I really going to do DM like this? Of course, dude. I. They, that's what they get for playing Dark Magician. Activate. We want to see a tuner. That's Researcher. That's another Roxy's. Uh, we're going for a Researcher here. I need another tuner. Because now I can go Halk. Or I could go Dragite. Let's go Dragite here. What's up, Rim? How's it going? <clears throat> Let's reveal. One. Is it just Adam Spider cards? Nope. Rock monsters. One, two. And then I can change the order. It doesn't really matter. And let's proceed to battle. LeBonk. LeBonk. I was really hoping he didn't have something random like an effect... Like a... Uh, not an effect trailer. A... Um, Battling Boxer Veil or Swift Scarecrow or something like that. That would have been super sad, but no, it's all good. We good. We got it. I'm probably only going to do a few duels with this build. Because I want to try and get the adventure stuff. And then we will... We're close. We just need two more cards. Two more UR cards. When the Scarecrow is Lay Swifty. Indeed. This is a hand. It's not the greatest hand. In fact, it's a pretty... Alright, fantastic. Uh... <laughs> What? Huh? His name is Ban. Yeah, no duh. No duh, his name is Ban. I'm gonna report him. Uh, uh, he disconnected? I don't, I don't know, he left? He surrendered before he did anything? Apparently my opponent said that that hand was enough. It's probably because my opponent drew like five dead cards. I mean, given the deck that they were playing and the list that they had, yeah, probably. It was probably just five dead cards that did absolutely nothing. Okay. So this is interesting. So I think the play is to normal 
Analyzer. Special Researcher. His Adamant's beta radar went off. <laughs> seeker! Seeker! Maxi! Imperm! Yeah, okay, I whiffed on that one. Why is it whenever the... Whenever it matters, I never seem to get what I need. Supplier! Okay, we got Supplier. We're good. That's literally the only thing we revealed. Fantastic. Let's search out Guardian. And then... Hmm. This is interesting. I think we go Raptite. And if we get Nibiru, we get Nibiru and we cry. Uh, just hope and pray they don't have specifically Nibiru. Looks like they don't have specifically Nibiru. Fantastic. I, uh, yeah. Oh, there's Guardian. Oh, fantastic. Ooh, there's also Seeker. My opponent has surrendered. Cool. I really feel like excavating needs to be faster. It just needs to be faster. It's so slow. Even now, even though they already have sped it up, it's still too slow. And it makes me sad. Hey, this is rank up. I mean, we're also in plat five, so there's that. It's not much of an accomplishment. I have a feeling my opponent's gonna have me go set first. And, uh, or they're just going to disconnect entirely. Okay. Don't know... I don't know why that happens. It's so weird. Because, like, that's happened so often where a person will win the coin flip and then just, like, disconnect. I'm like, what the hell? Ew, Stratos! Oh my gosh, it's... Uh, it's weird. It's weird, I don't like it. Okay, we have Doki Doki. Ah, uh, okay. It should just show the top five cards immediately. True. All right, we're gonna special the researcher here. Should I? Maybe not. Am I? Yes. <clears throat> We can always go into Halk with this as well, so it's not terrible if I whiff, but yeah, we really don't want to whiff. Oh, Roxy's off the top. Roxy's was the next card. That is fantastic. Uh, I can't go for Seeker, so let's just go Roxy's here. Now, we have a few options, and I think the best one is to just go for the Roxy's line. Why is there no Karibo, mate? That is a good question. Because there's a Sangan, mate. Uh, we're going to banish the Ash from hand. I drew called by. Wow. I'm just the better player, guys. Guys, I'm just the better player. I'm playing right into Nibiru, but in all honesty, because I already have the Block Dragon in hand, I'm not too worried about it. We need Karibo, mate. I agree. Karibo, mate, when? Make it one of those, like, legendary ones that's super cool. Well, this isn't the greatest, but I guess we'll summon out this guy. And then we can go for... I can go for Halk here. And special out the four... Yeah, let's go. Let's go, Hulk. Chris Strawn, Hulk, Vibrex. 
And then we can special summon out... Oh, I can't special before. Why did I think I could special before? Because I'm dumb. True. True. <laughs> Alright, let's go one, two... We'll keep the link in the grave. Uh, yeah, we'll go one, two, three. Out comes Block Dragon. And then we can go... Get Rome. And then we can go chain link one, blocky boy, chain link two, mecha phantom beast. Not that they have an ash or anything. We can go with this. We can add Seeker, which we haven't used. We have the Gigantes. And yeah, I guess we have the researcher here. So now, we'll link off into Union Carrier with these two. Oh, I could have done these two. Eh, it doesn't really matter too much. And then we can go Seeker. I'm surprised that my opponent has not scooped. Oh, there it is. <laughs> Ask and you shall receive. Alrighty, cool. Did I get any more UR material? I don't think I did. Oh, I did. I got eight. Cool. And now I have 500 gems. Mm -hmm. Normal summon a monster in ranked. Destroy a card in ranked. Declare an attack. Inflict damage to your opponent. Well, guess what? I ain't ever gonna do any of that because I'm playing Adam Spader and people don't like me. They say no. I don't want to play. Um, do I have enough? Nope. Nope. All right. Do I have anything I can dismantle? Really? I could technically dismantle this. I could probably dismantle seals because I am planning on opening or doing the uh, Dragon Maid on this account, but mm. I could technically get rid of Scythe. Ah, I don't know. It's fine. Let's do... I've already done my solo mode missions, so I'm not getting any gems from that other than actually the gems from the solo mode. So, you know what? We'll just keep doing. Yeah. Let's do uh, Let's do a deck that is unchanged with the Adventure Engine update with Ritual Beasts. So let's do this. I guess technically you could play Ritual Beasts with... Ow. No, you kind of can't. I'm going first! When does the event start? In like seven hours. Well, that's... I don't know if that's when it exactly starts. Maintenance might start then for the event. I don't know when. I think the event just starts in like seven hours. I don't know if there will be a maintenance or not. Oh, cool. My opponent has disconnected because they misclicked. Communication timed out. Oh, maybe we just were too... Maybe he just had terrible internet. Maybe that's what it was. He just had terrible internet. Kind of weird that there are no ritual monsters. Look, I agree. But that doesn't mean that they're bad. Should I call them spiritual beasts instead? This is a really good going second hand. Ash Maxi. Uh, I have to negate that. Cool. 
Called by? No called by. Fantastic. Oh, you love to see it. And then they just drop right of Aramis here, and I go, no! Oh my gosh! <laughs> I hate this game. <laughs> no! <laughs> Uh. Oh yeah, ambush. That's what I needed. Add Griffin. Send Karos. Oh. Oh ho ho. I see. Wow, that is phenomenal. That is fantastic. That is what you like to see, baby. A pot of prosperity. And a set card. Okay. <clears throat> what am I getting? Win. Win. Uh, let's start with pot of prosperity. They don't have ash. It's just that simple. So let's go one, two... Three, four, well, three, four, four, five, six, five, six, sure. Why didn't he just summon Griffin on his turn, on your, on my turn? Uh, because he's dumb, obviously. Rampangu, Pelio, ooh. I think I want Elder, don't I? Uh, ooh, or is Rampangu better? Let's actually go Rampangu here. And then let's go win. Pitching the Rampangu, because I can bring it back with Zephyra. If he lets this go through. Or, sorry, if he doesn't let it go through, I can bring it back. That's what I was thinking. I wanted the negate there. Because now we can normal this guy, and we're off to the races. Fantastic. And with three set rows, back cards, that set that. Uh, yep. Um, let's banish... We gotta banish the ulti, because we want Ken Hawk into rotation. Running him in Thunder Dragon. Uh, yeah, this Shotos is very good in Thunder. All of those, uh, Arch Nemesis are very good in Thunders. Um, notably, I don't get a... I don't get a tag out, but that should be fine. I guess we'll add follow-up then. What do I have banish? I have that guy banish. So let's add a Laura to hand. And let's go one, two, three. And then before he has the ability to do anything, I'm gonna go one. And I am going to pay the cost for my I.O. during standby, because I do want it to be open. So that now he can't use either of these guys' effects, and we have Macrocosmos up, which means if he goes for any of his Tri Brigade stuff, that's also turned off. Out comes Ram Ram. You're joking. Your mother trucking joking. Wow. Wow. Yeah. 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 I guess I just lose. They're just a better player. They drew the single out that they play in their deck.
Can you pop it? Oh, probably macro. Oh, no. Pops the IO. Yeah. Oh, you're gonna give me back the macro? I will take it. 16 material Zeus incoming? That's fine. Add back the wandering. All right. Then on that, I guess I have to special here. Let's go one, two. Yep, out comes wandering. Which means now if they make Zeus, they're way worse off. So let's go you and you. Because they'd have to get rid of everything if they want Zeus. Out comes Corvo. Oh, look at that. It's a four. Yeah, they'd have to get rid of all of their adventure stuff for a Zeus resolution. We get to keep Rampengu, which is huge. Because that means I can I can either activate the Rampengu to try and bait out the Wandering Griffin Rider. I mean, they do have the two mat Zeus. Empty. Um, sure. Welp. Crap. Cool. Fun. Literally, they needed the, the exact card that they had. They needed the exact card that they had. Disgusting. Horrible. Awesome. They needed exactly a Zodiac. Win. Yeah, that doesn't do anything. Cool. Cool, dude. Awesome. Just have this. Just draw the out. Only play three of it in your deck. Just draw it. Doesn't matter. Doesn't matter. Just draw it. Loved that. That was super fun. And even if I had attacked, it wouldn't have done anything. Which is the other thing. It's like, oh, well, why didn't you attack? Well, it wouldn't have mattered. Cool, fantastic. <sighs> Master Duel feels like that a lot of the time. That's this meta. It's just like, all right, everybody has just like an instant win button. So you're just like, okay, well, cool. I guess I lose. Uh, we'll get rid of the unicorn and the IP. Cool, no ash. I. <laughs> wow, all of these are bad. All of these options are bad. I could just grab Nibiru. I guess I could do this and then add. Let's go win. I could add Winda here and just set Winda and pass and hope that that's enough. I could also go and search this guy. And then I could special, and I could go into a link to of this. Which doesn't really do anything. I, I guess my best option actually is to just go Can Hawk here. Can Hawk. I mean, I technically have one, two, three interruptions. So there's that. 
Yeah. And we know that one of their cards in hand is Max C. So we'll banish the window. But they probably have, let's be honest, they probably have Harpy's Feather Duster or something like that. Orochi. Oh, cool. I love this card. Mm, so fun. <clears throat> Pot of Desires. No, I'm good. Yeah, I was like, I'm pretty sure it's Grand Machu. I, I, I was gonna say, I doubt that it's Luna Kaiju. What are they sending? Bigfoot. Uh. Yeah, sure. Not really anything I can do about that. Activate steeds, I guess. Twin tours. Well, aren't you just the coolest? Well, aren't you just the coolest? Draw the twin. Sure. Can't wait for the normal Sangin. Oh, no. Don't say that. No, they're gonna just normal the Grand Maju and then I die. Okay. Not dead. They are very low on cards. I just need to draw like one playable card to survive a turn. And I'm fine. Now, what's the likelihood of that? Pretty slim. What am I going to play in No Extra Deck Festival? Dark Lords. I'm technically not dead, unless he summons another monster. Some Luna Kaiju can summon Baron on the first turn. True. I live on a hundred if he doesn't summon a monster. Top deck it. Top deck it. Cool. I loved that. <sighs> Losing, you'll lose your soul. No. Oh, this guy's got this stupid upstart goblin icon. Oh, he's probably playing some bullshit like Numeron. No. Wow, this hand is tragic again. One, two, pass the turn. I guess I could have normaled the win. That probably would have been better, but... <sighs> they drew the harpies, it's fine. Add a prank kid monster. Um... Yeah, I'll do this, and then... Chain Macro. Why didn't I activate that earlier? Because I'm dumb. True. I don't think Macro Cosmos really does much against this deck. It might. I don't remember exactly how their cards work. I don't know if they need to be sent to the graveyard or if they just need to be used as material. Yeah, I, I don't know if the pranks activate when they're banished, but... 
Oh, they might just disconnect. I would love that. Cool. At least I don't de-rank. This is what you get for using the upstart goblin icon. True. True. Literally the worst icon. I hate... Every time I duel against someone with that icon, it always feels like they're playing some degenerate bullcrap. And I just want to die. Or they play it in a way that's degenerate and unfun to play against. And you're just like, cool. Wow, this is a hand. That's it. It's just a hand. I use the Colossus Icon. This is a hard one per turn, right? Nope. Fantastic. Degenerate Icon. Indeed. Watch it not matter. My opponent's going to, like... What? Yeah, dude. You got it. Flunder. I mean, Thunder Dragon, so it's only fitting. Ah, uh, yes. Um, I'm gonna do this now. I'm gonna pop this. What a hand, indeed. I'm gonna pop this Robina. Before my crap gets tributed over. I like your content. It's pretty swag. Let's go! Just don't draw map and we're happy. He drew map. I can sense it in my bones. End phase! Woo! Alright, we made it to the end phase, ladies and gentlemen. <clears throat> and I drew maximum C. Mmm, fantastic. Love it. Do I just normal the max? I just normal map. I'm just gonna normal max C. What are you gonna do? What are you gonna do? You know? I'm gonna get in the 700 damage. Actually, I'm not. I'm gonna get in the 500 damage. What else is the maxi gonna do? You know? <laughs> yes. Uh, uh, it's awful. Run evenly matched? I should. Oh, cool. That is like the end of the game. Well, not quite. No, it is, because they have this up. It is the end of the game. <sighs> game, why did I not get something after resolution? Oh, because the effect is still resolving. Uh, that's the end of the game. I... Uh, uh, yep. Yep. What do you think about Dragon Maid, Dragon Link? Uh, Dragon Maid. Terrible. Dragon Link. Pog. I just want to win, like, two more games so that I can get enough UR material and gems to make my stupid deck. That's all I'm wanting. That's all I ask for. You're probably better off playing pure Dragon Maid. No, you're better off playing literally anything other than Dragon Maid. Dragon Maid is not good, I'm sorry. But only kind of. I don't know, Banish Access Code. Oh, cool, they have Ash. Oh, they're so skilled. Yeah, you got it, dude. Literally can't beat an Ash Blossom there.
Man, this deck has so many issues. Because, like, you want to go first. Because, like, you can play Macrocosmos and stuff like that. And you get your combo off. But your combo sucks. So you want to play, like, Equalizers. Like, Evenly Matched. And droplets. And stuff like that. So you can break boards. And then sometimes you draw hands like this and it doesn't matter. You're, you're golden. It's fine. This hand is crazy. Ash should be limited to two. That is one of the worst opinions I've ever seen. Thanks, man. Actually a good hand. Impossible. I know. Man, I want DDD meta. No, dude. When DDD meta is meta, it's so boring. I really want to come back, but I don't have any new cards. Uh, you can still play a Tribe of Gate stuff. Oh, was trolling. It did not come across that way, but I can understand. I get it. We do a little trolling here. Ash limited to three. Love that. 10 out of 10. Maxi to two. Fantastic. Best ban list. What deck am I using today? Right now, we're using Ritual Beasts. Oh, now he activates this. Um, well, I'll just chain. And uh, we'll bring these two back. I don't need the search. It's fine. Maxi to negate infinity. Exactly. And then we will banish the... The... Apelio, sure. Now I could special, or I could just rely on these two and say I'm not gonna die. And in all honesty, I probably won't. Take your neg one. Unlimit pot of greed. Max C to four, of course. Okay. We do a little trolling. Kaiser Coliseum. Uh huh. Uh huh. Oh, okay. Goodbye, Kaiser. Goodbye, Kaiser Coliseum. Oh, there's Rose. I'll take it. Add Rose. Just negate activation. When a monster would be special summoned, or a monster effect is activated. Ah, I see. It doesn't negate the summoner activation. I'm just gonna no. Dark Lord, Dark Lord XL to zero. Too much advantage. Can't have it dominate like it did in Duel Links. True. Going second decks and best of ones are absolutely insane and definitely deserve to be hit because they're actually very strong in best of ones. Uh, yeah, I don't know what else to say. I don't know how you would hit a going second deck, but like it's in best of threes, you can just like play the side deck around it and like you can play to go second, you can play to go first, stuff like that. Um, and you can actually like interact with the decks more. But when you don't know a kaiju is coming down, it's a lot harder to plan around and to work around. Uh, yeah, I think I'm going to send the pedal fin to the grave. Oh, they have ash. Oh, no. Anyway. <clears throat> All right. 
The deck match is a surprise opponent, but going second to wipe uh, is amazing in best of one. Of course. Let's go and banish the Laura. I haven't normal this turn. So I would like to normal. I just have to accumulate lethal, which may take 60 years, but uh, I'll do it. Let's send the Canahawk to the grave, and we'll special the Apelio. I detect zero maidens. Oh no. Oh no. Alright, let's go Elder. I think how much damage we would have here. Not a lot. Not enough. I assume everyone here plays Yu Gi Oh to some degree. Let's be honest, none of us have maidens. True. Uh, we want a special window here. Do, 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 do. I'm surprised Nibiru hasn't come down. Let's see. Uh, what if we not normal? Do we have normal to Rampangu? So let's go for Rampangu. Although, it would be better to... Uh... Yeah, let's do this. Let's banish the Rampangu. Because then we can normal when special the Rampangu. Yes. Yes. So let's go in for another one of these. Do it again. And then this time I'm not going to be able to tag out. Yeah. So let's send you and you to the grave. Because I don't really want to return much. Haven't seen Nib in ages? That's weird. Now that's a weird one. Okay, and then we normal you. And then we normal you. And we activate the effect. And we special the Rampangu. And we activate the Rampangu. And we're gonna send the Kenahawk to the grave. Or, I guess, it's all gonna get banished. And then we're gonna go for... I could go for that guy, but I think I gotta go for this guy. And I've messed up my arrows, but only slightly. I have something in the grave, yes? Okay, I do. Fantastic. Uh, and then this should be lethal. Uh, we'll banish the Laura. Normal window. Cool. <clears throat> All of these attacks have to connect, and good. Because of Fluent Adventure? No, Nibiru is super good against uh, Adventure. It isn't very good against Flunder, I will say that, because they don't summon five times. They summon four most of the time. <clears throat> True Draco Monarch Festival? Yeah, that's what it's going to be. I'm not going to get anything here, am I? Nope. Nope. Do I have... I don't have anything I can dismantle, do I? So sad. I feel sorry for your poor opponent. Me too. That's why I stopped. <laughs> That's why we're no longer doing that. Um, Man, I really just have... Nothing! Nothing to dismantle! I could try and pull, like, individual packs. <sighs> nah. It's the true, true Draco festival. True Draco is dead, dude. True Draco's not, not getting out of that one. I'm sorry. There ain't much that true Draco can do. Given the fact that uh, a lot of their cards are already limited. 
a lot of like the cards that are actually played by them. Do I have 200 gems? Let's go. People will still play it. Yeah, that doesn't mean it's gonna be good. <laughs> Bro, shut up. Eldritch about to take over the next event. Like a dang plague. Uh, yeah, probably. That's that's one thing is like, the next event is just going to be Eldritch. They forgot Eldritch. I don't know how, but they did, which is hilarious to me. They hit literally like everything else that could have been a problem. Even Megalith, which I don't think would have been a problem. And they're like, you know what? We're just gonna leave Eldritch alone. Main decking evenly matched. Do it. Main deck the match of evenly. Alright, now I'm gonna attack my opponent's life points directly. Do I love when my opponent's two back row don't do anything? Megalith, oh Megalol. Yeah, I... That's one of those things where it's like, there are significantly better options in a no extra deck format. Why is Megalith the thing that's limited? I mean, to be fair, it is good with... Um... We're gonna play Blue Eyes here. Blue Eyes. Uh, we're... Sorry, Megalith is good with Drytron, so maybe that was like an indirect hit to Drytron, because they hit a lot of the other Drytron stuff. I drew both Celestial and Dasher, because I am the greatest duelist to ever duel. What the actual fluff? <laughs> I hate this game so much. Um, what do I want to go into? I guess I want to go into, obviously your boy. Seeing all those Eldritch traps get banished, just peak endorphin release. Yeah, they hit both Herald of Perfection and Herald of Ultimateness. Literally both of them. Sonic Birds, Spicy Tech, and Shino Birds. Someone asked me to play uh, Chino Birds next. They were like, play Adventure Chino Birds. And I was like, what? Why? Why would I do that? That sounds like a terrible idea. What do I have engraved? Oh, yeah, I have Adhara. Which would lock me into worms. Which does nothing. Cool. I love Chino Birds. Of course. Chino who? Exactly. Oh yeah, we're definitely not, we're not playing Shino Bird. Anything. Though I like the idea. It's kind of funny. <sighs> Yawn. It's a good board. Play Egyptian god cards? No. They don't even have a summoning animation. Come on, why would I do that? Shino Bird and Drytron for flu? Interesting. Uh, yeah, we only gate and destroy that. Sure, why not? What kind of hand is that? Great question. No idea. I literally can't tell you. Luckily, we're playing in solo mode, so it doesn't matter. I switched to solo mode to get some more gems. Oh, right. This isn't a hard once per turn. I forgot. Yeah, that's okay. I sent literally every card out of his hand. It draws Polly for turn. Monster Reborn. No. Or 
Shorter's Arctic with what? What the heck is SD? SD's nuts. Thank you. Oh, you back. You back. Skill drain. Ah. Ooh, Jet Synchron. And now I make this guy. We're gonna send Fusion Destiny of the two materials from my hand. <laughs> <coughs> change this guy to dark. That would have been funny. Yeah. Send Polly. Yeah, I'm playing polymerization in this deck. 100%. It's weird that Cyber Dragons don't run Dice Smasher. What the heck is Dice Smasher? A 92% chance of preventing your opponent from activating monster abilities. That's whack. He drew off the top foolish burial. Oh wait, it doesn't do anything for him. Yes, of course I run Fusion Sage. Sure, why not? Dash her out the Psychic Wielder. Dice Smasher? I hardly know her. Here you go, Hamez. There's your joke. I said it before you. <laughs> Fusion Sage is probably older than half the people playing this game. Do you do know that this is quote-unquote a children's game, but it's not actually a children's game? No children plays this game. Except... That's a lie. At my local, I do have some kids who play. Well, I have a, there, there's like one girl who's like, I don't know, nine or something. She comes with, she plays with her dad and her brother, goes to locals with her family. Really. It's very cool. And she plays, uh, she has a blue eyes deck with Chaos Max Dragon. So, of course, I clap it every time. Just any time that she is playing that deck, it gets wiped. Absolutely destroyed. Alright, cool. Well, I have a Dagda on my field. It doesn't do anything. It's so mean. It's a Blue Eyes players. I don't care. Are the kids good? Uh, no. I mean... They're a child. Of course they're not good. I summon my 10 to gate board. <laughs> no, I'm playing Dark Lords. Like, I'm not playing anything good. It's just like, I happen to have the out. Every time. I play branded Dark Lords, and so she summons the Chaos Max, and I'm just like, alright, so Mirror Jade effect? And she's like, no! <laughs> not only bullying a blue eyes player, but also a child. Of course. <laughs> Have you met me? Of course I bully people. Those poor blue eyes players. No! I have been punished. It's fine, I have the one card Halkafibrax combo. Let's giggity giggity go. Yeah. I haven't been to locals in forever because I've been busy on Saturdays and it's sad. Because I want to go. Locals are fun. Imagine seeing someone using a full on Eldritch Floodgate deck against a 10 year old explaining to them that they can't play the game. She activated summon limit on me. She knows about floodgates. <laughs> I feel no remorse. <laughs> Alright, how comes this guy? Here we go. I'm gonna go with Dagda. No. I'll go with Link Karibo. This is a Cyrus, never mind. I don't know why I did this. I wasn't really thinking, but oh well. What wording? Why am I. <laughs> why am I bragging about destroying them? <sighs> I'm 
not. I'm bragging about beating a Blue Eyes player. I don't care about your age. You're a Blue Eyes player. You deserve the loss. Here, take this L. You get your free parking. We didn't... I... I... I feel no remorse when a Blue-Eyes player summons Blue-Eyes Chaos Max Dragon. And then also... <clears throat> excuse me. Sorry. Uh, they summon Blue-Eyes Chaos Max Dragon, and then they also activate Summon Limit. Yeah, I don't... I don't really care anymore. So... I'm bragging about making children cry. Exactly! Child? Disgusting. Get out of here. I like that I have a Nibiru in my hand. This is feeling great, dude. Do I have a... I do. Oh. Normal summon Nib for more damage. True. That's what I should do. Red Rose. Dude, the Red Rose uh, engine is crazy. Why'd it have to be so strong? You think I'm not gonna normal summon Nib? Bruh. Of course I'm normal summoning Nib. Alright, let's do this. And then we'll chain this. Fantastic. Ramp. Ramp. Can't really get over that. Well, I could have. I could have just walked over him. And then I can make Verte Anaconda. Sick. Or I could do Jet. I could go Jet Synchron. Normal nib. It's what Yugi would do. <laughs> that doesn't make it that doesn't make it good, but I'm doing it. <laughs> make them flip their lid. That is um a sentence, I guess. Alright, we'll pitch the one for one to bring out. Extra damage! Wait, what do I have in grid? Oh, I have Link Karibo. Alright, let's go to battle. I have a singular negate. I'd rather you not do that, thanks. Please do not destroy my monster. Oh, banish it face down. A boomer pet <laughs> boomer sentence, so it gets fast. Wait, what? Who said what? Huh? Uh huh? Nib for game. Oh, I could have attacked with Rock Rose and then Jet Synchron for game. That would have been funnier. I'm itching to tribute summon. <laughs> True. No, actually, that was probably the optimal play, which is why it's so funny. Do I not get... I get nothing else? Okay. Alright, we're done. We're done with this one. I want gems! Give me gem! Nope, I just clicked that one. Enforcers of Justice. Alright, here we go. Yo, have you heard the Light Sworn story? It's pretty boring. I really wish they elaborated more with a lot of the uh, stories. They could have said a lot more. Could have made it more interesting. But then they would have also had to translate that into so many different languages, which would have been a pain, let's be honest. Yo, Lightsworn Gate is hype in comparison to literally literally like half of the other gates. It's better than that stupid SP challenge gate with heroes. Should we do that again? Oh, that'll be so fun. Activate solar recharge. What if I don't want him? Hmm. The Herald Gate? That one was easy. Yeah, that's that's fair. Yo, Beastie Boy. 
Here he come. Here come the boy. To be fair, yeah, Light Sworn, not the most fun. But, in terms of the gates that we have to play, it's one of the better ones. This is why I want, like, a Dark Lord one. Because that one, no matter what they do, even if they just royally screw up Dark Lords, uh, it'll still be fun. Because the story of the Dark Lord cards is pretty interesting. At least, fairly interesting. They should give us, like... A Burning Abyss one, and a Phantom Knights one, and a, you know, actually good, interesting, fun archetypes to play. The Orcus one would be fantastic. That would be super dope. And we're going to play the Loner deck. It's probably going to be faster. And an Atagonister one. That one would be... Well, that one's just, like, the Vrain's anime. So that one doesn't really need a story. <laughs> that one already got a story. Showing eggshell would make the line of Dark Lord players skyrocket exponentially. Exactly. Oh, cool. I drew Honest. <clears throat> Dark Lords have so much potential for lore. True. Alright. It's simple. I will mill Wolf. I, I didn't. I didn't mill Wolf. Alright, let's battle. I'm just gonna crash. Was there a reason to do that? Not really. Was there a reason not to? No. Not really. Oh, hello. <clears throat> Damage calc. Into the brains. Yes, you really should reread sometimes there. I'm not gonna lie, that was, uh. Yeesh. Why am I doing this? I don't know, because I can. Because I'm dumb. Because I'm a dumb. Oh, cool. Never punished. I don't know what I'm doing. What am I making? Chris Sharn Hawk of Fibrax. I see Halk. I make Halk. I don't even know if it's the best thing to be doing. There are no applicable cards for Chris Ron Halka Fibrax. Uh -huh. What do you mean? What do you mean there are no applicable cards? I play two tuners? Oh wait, no, those are fours. I don't play a target for the- Why am I playing this card? I... Okay. Oh, cool. I added a Judgment Dragon. That's... That's nice. My... Yeah, yeah, I, oh, I see now. What am I tagging out into? Formula. And then I can go into... Nothing. Okay. Four end of me. Sure. I summon this in defense, right? No, just says summon it. Alright, I guess we'll go this guy. Wonder Magician. Oh, cool. Wolf. Borg. Why'd you put it in defense? That's. What? Pitch another one. Bring back the another one. Hulk counting as a synchro summon is ridiculous, of course. Yo, I can make actual. Well, I ought to do this. We gotta make the uh, Parsha, the As Avenging Knight Parsha. I forgot Hulk had a second effect. Oh, you won't. Trust me. 
Go to face up monster, your opponent controls, change his battle position. Sick. Switch it to defense. Let's banish a card. Goodbye. And now let's special summon this guy. For no real reason. I have lethal. I can literally just attack, but it's funny. I only used its second effect in the Animancipators. Uh, I've used its second effect a lot, and it comes up a lot in the TCG right now, because what you do is you make Halk, you make Dagda, Dagda sets Scythe, uh, and then with like anything else, you go uh, into the Wonder Magician on the opponent's turn, you pop the Scythe, Scythe summons itself, Link or Synchro off into Baron, Baron negate, Locked out of the extra deck. Yada yada. Judgment Dragon yourself? <laughs> That's just the like... <laughs> um... Hold on. This is just... It's Judgment Dragon yourself, except it's just this. It's just this. You should Judgment Dragon yourself now! That's it. That's the whole... That's the meme. I don't know why I thought that was so funny, but it was. Plus four, basically. <laughs> Summoning Formula and synchro Synchroing Baron with Block Dragon is pretty wild, indeed. I will see you later. <laughs> Good night, James. I drew the one of. You'll love to see it. This hand is tragic. It doesn't do anything. But I do have Nibiru. Which also doesn't really do anything. But, you know, I have it. And then just tribute some of the blue eyes. This is why I play one blue eyes. Do you really need more? What if I said no? I almost didn't activate the effect there. That would have been bad. That would have been bad. Oh cool, effect Veiler. <laughs> yes, I am going to special that out with Dasher. <laughs> Why not? I was joking? I can't tell when you're joking through text. You think your sarcasm comes across. It doesn't. Sarcasm, sarcasm is so difficult to read. Unless you actually put an emoji or a JK or something like that. Oh, I thought you... I. I thought you literally just meant you were going to go, like, to sleep. You were like, okay, well, I've had enough of this stream. This is getting weird. Goodbye. Good night, kind of thing. That's what it looked like. Don't. Me. I'll. You. Get out of here. <clears throat> What's the blue eyes even for? It's for nothing. I could just tribute it. I, I could just tribute some of it. That'd be funny. I'm not gonna, but I could. I don't have quite enough damage. A dang. But you know what I am gonna do? Because it's funny. Tribute and make Baron. Could have done that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That actually wouldn't have been a bad play. But no, I'm gonna do this. Instead of Baron, we have Borload. And a blue eyes. 
Minor spelling mistake. I win. <laughs> Sad. <clears throat> Peak gaming, indeed. Oh, another negate? Nah, I'm good. I don't need another negate. I need blue eyes, white dragon! Is there a Discord? Yes. Do I use the Discord? No. I should. But I don't. It's Raikou. No, it's not. I'm surprised. We found out what the blue eyes was for. Exactly. Why am I popping off on this bot? Because I want those 200 gems, baby! I should attribute summoned over these two for Nibiru. That would have been the funnier option. But it also would have taken more time, so... <sighs> Give me my gems! I'm only here for gems! Yes! The bot is molding. I don't know if the bot has a physical form with which to mold, but uh, yes. I DREW IT AGAIN! All right, bro. Why am I dumb? It's a good question. Doesn't matter. All right, how comes Link Karibo? Summoning Celestial instead of BP. Oh yeah, there were too many options for troll in there. Damn. I saw the one for one in the blue eyes and I just like my vision just tunneled and I was like at horror no 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 just make the blue eyes go away just make it disappear and then I proceeded to do just that um I would love to summon this but I can't do anything off of it so depression I still have a normal I could try and scythe block my opponent. That's funny. Doesn't do anything, but it's funny! True. True. Eh, just make the desk off. Oh. So confused there for a second. Um. Hmm. Yeah, let's just make this. Let's not think about it. When I trolled the UI, I really felt like the goaded spirit. <laughs> yeah. Normal the blue eyes so that they'll know robots will never beat us human folk. Of course. That's the play. That's the play, lads and lasses. I have so many options. Huh. I'm just making Baron. Just Baron. Alright. <laughs> Pass on Baron. And an Auroradon. It'll be enough, guys, I promise. Charge. Uh oh, spaghettios. Okay. The best helped on combo I've ever seen. Of course, dude. I'm amazing. Why is Horn finna break the board? No cap. True. How many monsters they got in the grave? You tribute this to special summon a Time Lord? I think I have to save my negate for that. Oh, just kidding. They linked it away. Fantastic. Out comes Lina. The Light Charmer. They're going to steal my blue eyes. I literally can't have that. 
Light's Horn about to judgment itself. Do it. Do it. Add Raiden. Alright, we're fine. <laughs> I'm not gonna lie, I did get a bit scared there, but we're good. We Gucci. Activate Baron, yeah, why not? Yeah, why not? Guess what we're bringing back? That's right, baby. That's right, baby. Let's freaking go. Doesn't that synchro four? Does using Dretron as a send? Sync 4 is used in Drytron. What Sync 4 is used in Drytron? I'm a little confused. Yo, I can activate the Vichetta. Alright, F it. Activate the Vichetta. Banish itself. Return the guy to the hand. And now I can activate the Atara. And add him back. Sure, why not? Hello, the Varklight turns Droplet off. True. Alright, now we activate the Mecha Phantom Beast. And I know what you're thinking. He summoned the Blue Eyes, so he's gonna use it. Uh, he's, he, obviously, he's just Kaiba, and he's just cosplaying as Kaiba. Wrong. Make Baron. <laughs> Make Baron! Why did I put this in attack position? Because I, I, uh, mm, reasons. Because I'm dumb. True. All right, normal Liatara. Go into, oh, hold on. Go into this one first. Not a true Kaiba enthusiast, of course not. There's a reason I made this quote unquote blue eyes deck. As l with as few actual blue eyes cards as possible. And it's because it's funny. And for basically no other reason. It's funny to watch all the blue eyes stands be like, This isn't blue eyes! Ah! Lose their mind. I would know because I played it in Magic Key and Drytron. Oh my gosh. LeBon. I have nothing that I can cross out designate here. So, there's that. An actual magic key player is rare AF. True. Future fusion is coolio. I agree. Future fusion is coolio. What is happening? You can banish this card, special summon a time lord from your Oh. Oh. Ignoring its summoning conditions. Um I actually have to negate that. That is depression. Oh no. Uh oh, spaghettios. Cause if they summon a time lord, I lose the game. Okay, that's not entirely true, but it's it's basically true. It's basically true. Why do I have 53 people, 55 people, watching me play solo mode with a terrible Blue Eyes deck? What is happening? It's fine. It's fine. This is normal, guys. I love calling anything and everything busted. True. You do. Yeah, we're gonna activate the Baron. I'm gonna summon out F it Dasher. Here for goaded tips and tricks with brick eyes. Indeed. Indeed. Alright, so now what I'm gonna do is I'm going to tribute summon the Vachetta. And now, we make another Baron! <laughs> Magic Key can end on six negates slash interruptions easily. Easily? Magic Key can play the game? I didn't know that. 
I was unaware that Magic Key had plays. Other than normal summon normal monster cry. Show us the secrets, please. Yo, 200 gems, let's go. Yes. No, I'm so close. I'm so close. <laughs> 10 UR points. That is the effect. They give you UR points. That's it, right? All right, what's the next one we're doing? Let's do... I would do this one because it's funny. How on snooze. Hey. Hey. No, Weather Painter takes too long. Let's do, uh, let's, let's do 6 Sam. Wait, do I have enough materials to unlock this? I don't know! Do I gain materials? Oh, I do. Okay, we're fine. Without Halton, you can end on three to four. Of course. <laughs> About to make me die of old age before you get the gems. Yeah, that's why we uh, decided not to do that one. Remember when 6am was tier 0 and not just the TCG, but Duel Links as well? Crazy. <laughs> ah, yeah. One Omni Negate completely shuts down 6am. Oh, what? You have an Omni Negate? Alright, good game. Next game. Weather Painter was the most painful one. I have to disagree. Uh, the most painful one are those stupid SP challenges with the loner decks. Oh, those are fun. Six Samurai Chads. Ah, oh, yes, most assuredly they are Chads. I like how they give me three stories, and then I finally get to play the game. They're like, hold on, hold on. We really got to set up the story of Six Sam. It's like, why did it have to be three separate stories? Why couldn't you have just given me any, uh, it all to me in, like, one? You really wanted to spread out those rewards? They're like, these rewards matter, trust me. I 100% every solo mode. Same. Not on every account, but yeah. Shien having an animation, but not the god cards, of course. Dude, you could say that about anything. Having an, a summoning animation and not the god cards. It's like, what? I feel like I should start a petition and get people to sign it for, uh, for getting the god cards animations. I don't even play it, but I'm like, come on. Like, this is dumb. Oh, I have to activate Pokemon. I'm sorry. Let's proceed to the battle phase. Yes, sir. Shien has a sword, though. True. I forgot. Do it, I'd sign it, of course. Everyone would sign it. That's you need it. The God Card's not having animations is the most tragic and unforgivable thing imaginable. Yup. <clears throat> All right, let's change up my deck again. Let's play... All of my decks take like six years to play the game. <laughs> let's play Dragon Link. All of these decks have like such long and arduous turns. At least Sphere Mode should have an animation. I Do you know how disheartening it would be if you just dropped a Sphere Mode and your opponent got a summoning animation? You're just staring at your board, just in disarray. That would be so sad. I'd love it. <laughs> uh, this just needs to be sent to the graveyard. If this card is sent to the graveyard. All right, let's go safer. Effect. Send. Special. Effort to Shrudo. Oh, oh, sorry. This adds to hand, I forgot. My bad.
special. Oh, it's another ad. My bad. I always think it's a special. It's not. It never is. It never will be. Stop thinking your special summoning stuff. Mr. Streamer, let us choose the next deck to use against the bots. Starter decks included. All right, sounds good. Will do. I'll let you choose out of the ones that I have. <laughs> nice 15 minute combo for a solo mode AI bot. Look, I'm not gonna make a thing just for solo mode. I'll just play this 15 minute combo, it's fine. Play the monarch structure. No. No, I don't think I will. Special Strudo. Do I have Yazi in this deck? No. Why? Because I'm dumb. Mr. Streamer, do a poll. Alright. Alright, there you go. I did a poll. Romulus, probably. Literally anything. Romulus! Add Ravine! <sighs> Send a dragon. Okay, we're gonna discard this maxi because I don't like it. And we're gonna send. Is there any good, any good sends? Anything good to send? Any, any send good? But these these specifically have to be sent from the field to the grave. All right, then let's send a chamber. I don't know why, but because I can. And now let's make. This one. Levy and added off saver. That's what I should have done. I'm bad at this deck. No idea what I'm doing. Not talking from experience, of course. Of course. <clears throat> I would never. Oh, I cannot special. Because I'm locked into darks. Of course. Alright, we'll tribute this guy then. We're gonna pop this guy. And then McBaron. Now, I could have had lethal, but I'm bad, so I don't. Nibiru. <laughs> Oh, if only. If only. <coughs> Excuse me. I'm dying. When the Baron is de floor. It's that whole piss shokan. Oh my gosh, it's dual wield. Well, I can't have that. Dual wield is such a crazy card. That's all. It's just a cool card. Crazy card. Alright, it's fine, guys. I got it this time. I'm gonna activate the Baron, because it's funny. Uh, we're gonna bring back the... Rocket. <clears throat> Why did I put it in defense? I literally have no answer for you. Why am I doing this the way that I'm doing it? Because I'm stupid and I have no idea what I'm doing. Ah! It's fine. Send rocket. And rocket. And add levy. It, look, it's fine.
It would be good if you didn't have to have only one 6M on the field to activate it. True. In Duel Links, it's crazy. In this game, it's a card. Well, I have to banish the safer here. Yes. Decide. Oh. Access code! Whip. Oh, even against an AI, I should not have won this. Jeez, this is bad. Fine. How old am I? Because you look like you're in your 20s, but you act like you're in your mid-50s having flashbacks. <laughs> uh, I am 7,000. No, I'm actually uh, 9,000. Over 9,000. Um, so there you go. I'm against an AI. Yeah, could you imagine if I wasn't? That would have been great. Warzone? Like COD? Yeah... I called Nibiru for nothing. <laughs> Look, that paranoia. It makes sense. Why do I have this card? What does this card do? <gasps> Yo, I gotta add two cards here. I don't I don't even know what to add. Uh, this guy? I don't, I don't know. Do any of these cards do anything? None of these cards do anything. Hand loop them. How? What am I doing? None of my cards special summon themselves. Alright, activate this. Do I even have a level 1? How much do you want to bet I don't even have a level 1? Alright, I'm just going to normal summon this guy. I was correct. When this card is destroyed by card effect while equipped to a monster. Fantastic. No idea. Am I supposed to proc that card? I feel like I am not. This deck doesn't even have the level 4 that special summons itself. Yikes. Hey, yo, I got another counter. Let's go, because my opponent's also playing the exact same deck. Fantastic. Don't put that in the Nibiru column. Don't do that. Don't do that to me. Oh, cool. Dual wield. That card... That card does stuff, right? I don't know. I don't know. I think it does. Oh, crap. None of these cards do anything. Target a face-up six samurai monster, equip this card to it, or unequip this card and special summon it in face-up attack position. It gains 500 attack and defense. And when it destroys an opponent's monster by battle, I get to draw a card. Sure. I guess? I don't even know. Alright. <laughs> it's fine. No extra deck? Of course not. That would make sense. I guess I just make this guy big. F it, make it, do this too. Pass. <laughs> Don't call my mother anytime soon. Aha! Uh -huh. Set card. Pass. Fantastic. Love it. Oh, cool. Another one. This card doesn't do anything. I love when cards don't do anything. <laughs> These solo mode decks were made by someone who doesn't play the game. True. Yo, dude, I deal 1,500 damage. Look at that. I don't like what's happening. That's not gonna proc me. Yeah, you get two attacks. Awesome. What? I. Yeah. Uh, uh, mm. <laughs> um. Cool. Uh, what am I supposed to do? Just draw. Just, just draw Sheen. You know what? I'd rather do the Dragon Link stuff. It may take longer in terms of combo, but at least I'm guaranteed to win. <laughs> Just draw a little forehead. Oh my gosh, this hand is trash. 
Oh, it's okay. I'm going second. Lost to the bots. Of course I lost to the bots. <laughs> uh, this hand is tragic! What the fluff? <sighs> Humanity is over. Night beam! Ah! It's fine. Don't equip to this guy. No! <laughs> <laughs> 2100 defense for no reason. What do you mean? Of course there's a reason for it. Okay, DZ. <laughs> no, I, I lose. I lose the game now. Stop! Konami, why? Why do you hate me so? I will not go. Carry me on. Carry me. Da -da 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 oh, cool. Yeah, just draw the. Ah! Okay, at least I get a draw off of this, right? At least I get a draw off of this. I drew an in! Why? Am I dead? Barely not dead, by the way. I don't have enough. Just draw the Sheen. You're kidding. How did I draw a more dead hand in 60 cards? I play one Levy, one Red Eyes Darkness, one Celestial. What? What? I said I was guaranteed to win. And the game said... Just gave me the biggest middle finger. Oh, and now I draw a decent hand. It's not crazy, but it's decent. It works. I guess we go recharger here. Or uh, tracer. Does striker dragon do anything here? Um, kind of. F it, striker dragon. Guaranteed to get clapped by Konami. Of course. If Night Beam hit face up cards, it would be cracked. True. Accur accurate. Kids watch this? I specifically make it so that kids don't watch this. What do you mean? Don't lie to me. Don't lie to yourself. Kids don't watch this. I'm not even sure humans watch this. Can I make Hulk? Make Romulus? Then I could discard this desk bot, 001, which does literally nothing. Okay. <laughs> I'm an alien. <laughs> there you go. I'm an alien. You're an alien? Ah. <sighs> oh, this makes me want to anyway. Oh, cool. Absorator. Absorator. So ooh. Hold on. Oh wait, no. Never mind. I place A counters. <laughs> no, he places A counters. I have a normal have I? Nope, of course not. Why would I? That would make sense, baby. Yo, I can make a 10 here? Oh my gosh, this is nutty. This hand is crazy. This hand is crazy. Or I should say these mills were crazy. And now... Silly songs with Larry. Oh, I can't make Baron! No! Just hit midnight, let's go. Let's go! I mean, I... Sure, let's do this. IP Mask Reina. What can I go into? Oh, no. I can't go into anything. <laughs> 
<laughs> no. It's fine. <sighs> Staying up late for the homies. Fools. Why would you do such a thing? Where's Larry and his silly songs? I'm sorry, do we now need to watch that because I made the reference? My bad, bro. Alright, well, it's time to pass the turn. What's happening? Add a level 10. Sure. Why am I not playing Unicorn? It's a good question. Fantastic. Before end of main. Sure. Proceed to the end phase. Sure. Pop. Pop. Huh. What other games do I play? Uh, Arknights. That's it. It's the only one. Why am I activating this? Because I'm stupid! True. Immediately lock myself into darks. No, I play a whole bunch of games, but... <clears throat> haven't played much. I haven't played much recently, other than, like, Ark Knights and this. Because <clears throat> why would I? That would make sense. Alright, cool. This game is over. Adventure Dragon Link ends on a completely different board than Adventure Tenyi. Yep. That's one of the reasons to play the different deck. Alright, cool. Snurden wants to be my friend. Nope, never did. I've never wanted to be anyone's friend. You think I have friends? Friends are for chums. I still think about those illegal sets you did on my turn. Wait, what? I did I did what? I do not remember this, but okay. I'm still waiting for the actual god card, Boral End Dragon. What does Boral End Dragon do? So many people have been like, Boral End, it's the end of the game. You win. You win if it resolves. And I'm like, huh? This hand is tragic. I. All right, I'm just gonna pass the turn. All right, what does Boral End Dragon do? Let's find out, because 6 Sam is boring. Okay, I just pulled it up. Boral End. Cannot be destroyed by battle or card effects. Also, neither player can target this car this monster with monster effects. Specifically monster effects. Okay, that's pretty good. Uh, it is a Link 5 that has a lot of attack. Good to know. Uh, this card can attack all monsters your opponent controls once each quick effect you could target one effect monster on the field and a rocket monster in the graveyard negate the effects of that monster on the field special summon the monster from your graveyard your opponent cannot activate cards or effects in response to this effects activation wow that card is good it's not crazy but it's not it's really good for specifically dragon link and for like nothing else because if you're not getting this effect it's useless <clears throat> it's pretty good, though. Uh, a Link 5 is weird. Though. And it does require 3 plus effect monsters, which makes it a little bit more difficult to make. Uh, however, it's very good. It's very good. What do you mean? That's a lovely hand. I can see why so many people were hyped about Dragon... You what?! You what? You activated anti-spell fragrance? What? I wasn't paying attention and the game was just like, hey, by the way, uh, no, you don't get a play. Borland is interruption and he had divine wrath. Thought it was going to be some Atticanist or Spice? No. The bot really said, uh, you are not going to have a good day. <laughs> the bot thinks it's a YCS. 
<laughs> I hate that. I hate that that's true. Do I just make Predaplant Verte Anaconda? What can I potentially go into? Like nothing? Because stupid freaking anti spell? Yeah, I guess I just make uh, Verte Anaconda. Isn't that card in the... It might be in the TCG. I think it just came to TCG. Ending on Boral and IP Mask Arena, Snow and Grave, Abyss, and Savage is kind of wild. True. Oh, I forgot to activate this effect first. Oh well, I'm stupid. Pop the anti-spell because rude! I want to activate my spells! Pieces. I like that I still have this poll going on. For no reason. I have no reason to have this poll. It's not doing anything. It's just gonna stay there, though. Alright, let's go Collapse Serpent. Special. Link into... Romulus. Dude, I love drawing both Collapse Serpent and... Wyver Burster. That is my favorite thing to do. Mm. 10 out of 10. Rocket Tracer. That's actually a phenomenal draw. Fantastic. Because uh, now we can do this. And then we can do this. And special summon a rocket. I can no longer special another monster. Let's go. What do I need for lethal? I just need this, I guess. Good to see my little snow cone growing. That is a weird sentence. But, uh, okay. Um, okay. Can't wait to sp Bank a full board of flu birds with Boraland. That is a sentence. That is a sentence. It exists. <laughs> she am looking like, what is this card over there? Exactly. Uh, yes, officer. This man right here. Let's go, 200 gems! Let's go! Alright, we're done with solo mode. Get out of here. We can now open a pack. Let's go! Alright, we want Water Enchantress. That's the only one we want. We just want the Water Enchantress. That's it. That's all we need. Just give me Water Enchantress. I will take other URs that I can dismantle into Water Enchantress. Let's go. Son of a... I'm gonna get Sunny. I'm gonna get nothing, apparently. Konami said, no, no, no. We gave you good luck last time. You can't have good luck two pulls in a row. Except against Flu. Yeah, no deck really does very well against Flunderies. Except for Flunderies. Flunderies does good against Flunderies. Son of a... Alright, it's fine. It's fine. One's got zero rainbow packs skipped and got five URs. Colors didn't mean much. Don't mean much. Uh, they do. It's... It's not a guarantee, but you're more likely. Hey, look, there's a UR. Not the UR we wanted. 
but I'll take it. Come on, baby. That's not a you are! Magic key cards, get out of my face! What even is this card? When this card is destroyed by battle and sent to the graveyard, you can special summon this card in attack position. Don't know why I looked at that card, expecting something. What the fluff? Birds on the feet. <laughs> Oh my gosh, these pulls are crap. My last two pulls, every UR I got was the magic key ones. Oof. Son of a. <clears throat> that stupid Utopia man. I'm so sick of him. I would have rather have pulled nothing from that so that I get a guaranteed UR in the last one. I got one. I got one UR. All right, we're doing one pack, I believe. I am trad. Uh, uh. F you, Konami. Curse you, Perry the Platypus. No. That's not what I wanted. <laughs> no. Uh, we have one card to dismantle. One. A singular card to dismantle. The Snowball. That does get us enough. To make. Not that guy! Oh! About lost my mind. It's fine. I can't fit more cards. No. What am I taking out here? Reasoning? Uh, no, reasoning's fine. Sell your soul to Konami and pull out the credit card. Literally can't do that. Well, I could, but... Uh, not gonna do that, because this is a free-to-play account. What do I want to take out? That is a good question. DD Crow? I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. I should probably play more of these. Oh, uh, I wanted to save my gems for the freaking uh, Dragon May pack, but eh, it's fine. So I had to craft the two and the two euro for my adventure engine. Yep. I probably should just take out reasoning, but I want to play it. But I want to play it. All right, we'll take out the Chaos Creator. I should probably play more Chamber. Cause that also gets my combo started. I'll keep Gamma. Cause it's a light. We'll take out a Maxi, maybe? Uh, we have the DPE engine. I could take out the crossouts. Hmm. Dragon, <laughs> true. Is this a Dragon Link deck? Yes, it is. Oh, I don't have the second enchantress in here. Whoops. Am dumb. All right, what am I dismantling? What am I dismantling? The pink? The winds? The Zeus? Probably Hieratic Seal. I can't dismantle anything. There's nothing to good to dismantle. All right, we're playing with one water enchantress for now. This is going to go terribly wrong. <laughs> is this some pile deck? Yeah, basically. Good friend of mine plays his way into Drytron Fairy. <laughs> yep. This is Depression Incarnate. You're Depression Incarnate. Maybe I only play the one rocket. Maybe I'll only play the one Rocket Synchron. Let me look up. You know what? Let's look up some decks. And before I do that, I'm going to go to the bathroom because I need to die. Dismantle win and dispose of the corpse. <laughs> no.
Okay, I'm back. <sighs> Been holding in that for a while. Hold on. There's something I want to look at. Together. Together. Alright. I wanted to look at the TCG Nationals. Because it's funny. So first of all, look at this board. Look at this meta. Look at how many decks there are. Disgusting. Do I have Hyper Librarian? No. It'd be nice, though. But look at the lack of Tri Brigade. It's disheartening. I love Tri Brigade. No one's playing it. <sighs> anyway, top decks. Guess what the top deck is playing? That's right. Mystic Mine, baby. Bringing e to 3 was a mistake. Uh, yes. 100%. Tri Brigade fell off. I know. It's sad. Tri Brigade is such a cool deck, though. In my opinion. Let's go, Mystic Mine. Guess what the second place deck was? That's right, Mystic Mine, baby! <laughs> and then it was Flunder! Whoa! <laughs> the TCG is doomed! <laughs> uh, I hate it here. Oh, no. At least Mystic Mine is banned in Master Duel. That's one good thing. Uh, what are we looking at? Dragon Link. There we go. PC, T, peak TCG right there, indeed. In the third game of the final match, the Sky Striker player tried so hard to out anti spell. <laughs> yeah, they kind of just flipped rivalry and he conceded. <laughs> oh, so fun! Look at how expensive this deck is. Why am I playing this deck? Because I'm a psychopath. True. Okay. Two Wide Reverster. Interesting. What are they cutting out? Oh, they're not playing Noctivision. <gasps> okay. Oh, they're also all playing Droplets, which I don't have. Uh-oh. Uh-oh, Spaghetti. Huh. That's not very good. Psycho Streamer confirmed. Exactly. I can send you a version of my Adventure Dragon Link deck. Nah, I saw Gucci. I'll figure it out. Uh, yeah, I guess we just, we can just take out, like, the Noctovision. Add in more hand traps, more equalizers, stuff like that. Drop it. Oh, do I have Foolish? I don't know if I have Foolish on this. Steam? <clears throat> do I have Foolish? I do not. No. Oh, I can play one for one. Evenly matched is good. I could play evenly matched as well. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Take out Nocto, take out that guy. What did I accidentally just remove? Oh, I removed to Destrudo. Nah, Destrudo's too crazy. Destrudo's too good. Too good. What if I just played 58 cards? Because it's funny. It's tempting. Steam recommending you some sus stuff. What was I don't know. I don't know what it was. I didn't even look. What if I just played in Imperial Array. That'd be funny. This is too many bricks. Is it, though? Is it? Is it, though? Let's look at Steam. Let's not. That sounds like a terrible idea. Oh, I could play the Rocks Rose stuff. I could also play snow. That stuff. Setting it off of droplet is actually insane too. <clears throat> True.
I don't have snow on. Wait, do I? Do I? Do I have snow? No. I have snowed as giant. For some reason. Uh. I could play the rocks rose or the the rose stuff. Which is never really a bad idea. Does this guy play Imperm? He plays the one of to hit with the cross out. So we could take out this, I guess. Yeah, I'm gonna play only one rocket as well. Okay, this'll wait, hold on. First of all, we definitely need the second striker. What am I taking out? Good question. I'm not playing Baron? Oh, no, I am. For a second, I thought I wasn't playing Baron. Uh, I could play Shooting Riser. Since I'm playing Destrudo, that does make sense. And then I could also play Snow, but I'm not playing Snow, because I'm... <sighs> I could play Pisty. But I'm also playing the DPE engine, so there's that. Should I be playing the DPE engine? Maybe not. <laughs> I could do the Cupid Pitch stuff. Maybe that's what I should do. Maybe that's what I should do. Play Cupid Pitch. And Colossal and Snow and all sorts of... Yeah. Yeah. We'll build towards that, but for now, this will do. I can't, I can't do that. Hold on, I gotta take something out. Take out the quad moral. Take out the apo. Is everyone playing apo? No one is playing apo. Fantastic. We'll take that one out. We'll take out. We'll take out quad moral. Uh, and I was gonna add in unicorn because I think unicorn's a little bit more useful here. I'm sure this will be fine. You can also send water enchanters for follow up. True. We'll do Cupid Pitch stuff uh, in the future. All right. I got this, guys. Get rid of that. I'm going to stop this poll because... I don't know. We weren't doing anything. Back into the mine that is ranked. Yeah, basically. How did I draw the Water Enchantress to start? That's crazy. All right. Starting with the Chaos Base. Ranked as a cesspool of degeneracy. That is by far the best way I have heard ranked explained. Yep. In fact, it is. Uh, we're going to go Water Enchantress now. I was trying to bait out an Ash Blossom. They didn't Ash, so there's that. Out comes the Rite of Aramazir. Right. I could normal the chamber, but it's not going to do anything. Fateful adventure. I guess I should just, I just, I just send it. Yeah. Yeah. We'll save the normal for like something else down the line. Everyone's so scared of mech knights. That they, uh, they never seem to, uh, to, um, place these in, like, a square. It's kind of funny. Alright, out comes this guy. I take off my glasses for one second, and everyone goes, whoa. The opponent is playing Flunderies or Kaijus. Probably. You're probably right. Out comes Wither. Wither Brister. Down comes Wyver Brister. Let's banish the chamber because... <laughs> 
Should I have banished the other one? Yes. Am I stupid? Yes. Am I realizing this now? Yes. Gosh dang it. <laughs> Alright. Romulus! Effect. I missed the no glasses reveal. Sorry, here, let me take them off for a second. There you go. Okay, so we grab the ravine. We activate the ravine. We pitch the this thing. All under and negate, which is the craziest thing. This is why adventure is absolutely insane. We do this. We send the... We send the abs router, and then we grab up this guy. I've already normal done. No, I haven't. Oh, but I can't activate the effect of a normal summoned monster. So, we still send this. Still send this. Activate the chain link one. Why can I chain block like this? This is disgusting. I hate my life. Uh, and then we get to equip. I'm gonna just get tribute over. It's just gonna be tri just tributed. I'm gonna cry. Add to hand the rocket tracer. And then I could just normal this. Does that do anything? No. True. Okay, and then we go like this. And we special summon the tracer. And then we go. Hmm. And then I go Halk with the Romulus. And I special out the the token. Hold on. I spe sorry, not the token. Uh I special summon out. Yeah, I think that's the play. Okay, so we're gonna go you and you. In my opinion, Orcus is unplayable unless Galatea is at three. Interesting take, but okay. And now we special summon out the Red Rose. Mm -hmm. I've got a new emote image, Snow. Oh dear. And then I can make a Baron, and I can special summon back, and then I can go into another Link. Out comes the Red Rose. Special. Activate. Add the Basil Rose. Shoot. I could go Striker Dragon to add this guy, and then I could go for an eight. That's probably worth it, actually. Yeah, let's do that. Let's ban it, or send you. Destroy this guy, grab the rocket tracer. Rocket tracer. Go into this guy. This would have been better if I was also playing Dagda Scythe, but oh well, it's fine. Driver, baby! Okay, there's Black Metal Dragon and Rocket Tracer. Uh, I'm gonna add to my hand, this has to be sent from field to grave. Yes. Sad. Then I'll just, yeah, I'll just add the rocket, or the black metal. Not the greatest, but it's not terrible. I didn't send a safer, which does hurt. Yeah, let's go Basil Rose. Let's bring back... I don't know, this guy. It doesn't really matter which one, since I've used them both. 
I could go seals, but seals doesn't do anything. I could go IP. And then IP would allow me an extra interruption with unicorn, because I could send the black metal. Uh, I think I'd just go DPE here. Not the greatest, but not the worst. So I have basically three forms of interaction. Fantastic. Um, sure. Harpies, Feather Duster. Is my Monopoly money go gone? Feather Duster, Raigeki, full combo. That's what's gonna happen. Fe no, it's Feather Duster, Raigeki, Droplet, full combo. So I activate the Baron on the Raigeki, and then they just droplet me, and then I cry. Like really hard. I meet you. Sure. Sure, dude. Add Picari. Wait, up, uh, right? Oh, a Chi Chi, sorry. Picari is the light one. Going second, add a Gnister. No, I think I won the die roll here. Add a level four or lower, add a Gnister monster. Um, what if I just negate this? Because that's that is their normal. I'm going to negate this. Negate the link one. Yeah, I probably should have. Yeah, I I was going to pop the spell. The combo was so long I forgot. <laughs> True. I'm just surprised that they didn't get- yeah, oh, there, there's the leave. I was like, just stopping the normal summon is also good enough, unless they also have the spell, in which case I just wait for them to activate it, and then as soon as it's done with its activation, I destroy it, because I don't- I think they can only activate one. This is why you always run going second cards? Well, they probably are. Uh, just kidding, they're not. They're running Arch Nemesis Pro. <laughs> All right. They're running two of this card? I refuse to believe that. You can activate the spell as much as you want. Uh, oh yeah, true. Yeah, you. it's it's only this one. If this card is in your graveyard, you can banish to set it. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Not three island, I know. They can set up a really killer board, to be fair. But if they go second, they're dead. They lose. The game is over. Most decks run one eye land. Really? That seems like a terrible decision. I'm not gonna lie. Oh, I think I just lose. Because they have maxi. Or they have dimension shifter, one of the two. Rather have the spare slots for going second cards.
That's interesting. Yeah, dude, cool. I love Maxi. Who here likes Maxi? Everybody raise your hand. Do I just seals pass? I think I just seals pass. All right. All right, dude. All right, dude. <sighs> seals DPE pass? I don't want to give him two guards. All right, now that I see the card that he drew for turn was Ash! Yeah, I think we're going to go uh, DPE. Just draw it for turn, dude. Just draw it for turn. You're just the greatest of all existence. <sighs> or just draw it off of the maxi, I should say. So cool. So fun. So based. Well, I'm only playing the one uh, Pocket Synchron, so it wouldn't have been a great add, but I could have added Tracer there. Which isn't terrible. Such a weird looking card. Alright. Kaiju me. Do it. I can sense it in my bones. Do it. Six cards. I have to play through six cards because Maxi. Necroface. What? Shuffle all banished cards into the deck. Uh, uh, oh, sure. Yeah. Yeah, you got it. Heretics are weird, weird in general. True. <sighs> what? You could special summon a level 4 or a lower mutant monster. You can only activate it once per turn. Um... Yeah, I guess I'm going to DPE this. Do you have another Max C? I refuse to believe this. I should have waited for it to actually activate. Oh no. It did activate. It just didn't resolve. Called by. Piss off. This is why I don't like Cult by. Because it can hit generic cards. Battle phase. I could tribute this one, which is funny. Tribute self, return to hand. Seal, summon. Could summon this. Is there anything in particular I want to go for? Yeah, honestly, this one. Tributing the Distrudo could have been the play. Yeah, it could have. But I wouldn't have gotten to special summon, which is the point. Another <laughs> called by would have been peak Yu-Gi-Oh. True. Yeah, getting, yeah, exactly. Getting the advantage off of the spheres is way better. Uh, I can actually add back the Rocket Synchron here as well. So, do I want to just special the Distrudo? I'll have other opportunities to do that. So let's go Striker Dragon here. Why is called by not once per turn? Because that would make sense. Level 3 tuner, though? Yeah, that is fair. A level 3 tuner is pretty nice. This boot sector launch isn't really going to do anything, is it? Not really. Alright. Rocket Synchron. Uh, 
Making the Destrudo a level 3 would have been way better. I mean... Okay. I don't think I need a level 3 tuner. I guess I could have gone Baron here, which is like... Okay. But I don't really need it for that. Let's go Destrudo. I mostly just need it for a tuner. And I wanted to save it in case I needed it. Uh, I could go for negate here. Because I don't really need additional follow-up. Yeah, let's go for the negate. Let's go chain like one. Chain like two. Because they might have ash. I'm getting nothing off of this except for two negates, which is very funny. Okay, now I can boot sector. I can also banish for this guy and special... Special four. Which would then give me another eight. Alright, let's go boot sector. Let's go boot sector. My opponent has surrendered. Special of four, make Baron. Yeah, I could have done that. But my opponent has now surrendered. Alright guys, I'm going first. Pray for me. It's the creepy mate. Exactly. I drew no hand traps, but a phenomenal hand overall. I can go safer pitch. Ooh, this is interesting. I think I start with safer. You have to start with Saber. And my opponent has the maximum C. Cool. A Dark Magician player going second in plat? I doubt it. Imperm. Imperm immediately. Wow, interesting. Um, okay. Uh, I, I didn't activate anything, so I just link off to Saber. <clears throat> Let's go boot sector. My opponent has surrendered because they have no idea how my deck works. Cool. What? 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 Okay. Blue Eyes players, what did you expect? I I swear I do not pay my opponents to uh, die. To just lose. Unplayable hand. Ha what the fluff? All right, uh, uh, go. <sighs> you pay them way more than me. Way more than zero is still zero. So. <sighs> well, I'm not dead. <laughs> But now this DD Crow sucks. All of the this hand. How do I draw? I play one of each of these. How? 
sure. Sure, dude. When the nuns hate vanishing. <laughs> True. <sighs> I played in 60 cards. I drew Boot Sector. Two, both Wyver Burster and Collapse Serpent. Basil Rose Shoot and DD Crow. All one ofs. Every single one of those is a one of. Hilarious. No. Exosister is just DPE pass. Really? That's not how I played it. Alright, pass the turn. <clears throat> I don't think I'm going to die. I could have had a dark to banish. True. But I the thing is, I don't think I'm going to die to Exo Sisters. Which is, so this is more advantageous. Dealing with a DPE seems like a better idea. Unless they drew really well. Faithful Adventure, sure. Ending on Spheres is pretty good. Would I have been able to end on Spheres though, is the question. Called by, cool. Ooh. Oh, they have Maxi. Yeah, that's the thing. It's like, he had DPE. So, like, I'd have to have been able to deal with that. Which I didn't. Verte looking at you with evil intentions. Exactly. There are a lot of cards that do a lot. That do a lot here. Granted, he probably has... Ma Son of a... Alright, it's fine. He probably has max C, which is an issue. Now I could go striker. Is there even a point to doing that? Not really. So let's go like this. I'm gonna pitch the Basil Rose. the trap. Um, sure. So, this is fine because I can go Dragon Ravine, send a dragon. I don't change, I don't, I don't move anything from Grave. Uh, so we send this guy. This guy searches out Axie. Short. Um, son of a. <sighs> yeah, yeah. No, that's fine. Uh, let's search to the hand rocket tracer, and then we're gonna attack into these two. Uh, so we're gonna normal this. He has another thing? What do you have? Oh, he has this. Okay, let's go to battle. Let's walk into this. Let's walk into this. Let's go main two. And make seals pass. Or can make Verte, which draws him two cards now. <sighs> DPE this fool, he gets two draws. I, uh, giving him one draw 
might prevent him from being able to activate this, which is good. So maybe going seals is worth it. I can also just go like Chaos Ruler and send everything and then just not activate anything. Just so that I have it. Seals is good though. Let's go seals. Yeah. <clears throat> it's Exo Sisters, they could draw 20 and still lose. That's not true. But yeah, I, I, I get it. Alright, well, we'll just pass on seals. Shuffle those two away. <clears throat> not when I have 2,000 life points. Um, sure. Oh yeah, that's why I didn't attack him. Because I knew they shuffled into the deck. So down goes that card. I can shuffle away the token. So I'm not like, dead. Do they benefit from being in the grave? Uh, the Exorcisters? No. Here comes the token. Do they have... Okay, out comes Faithful Adventure. Sure. Do they just equip it? Alright, so after that comes out, let's tribute this guy. Return this guy. Activate effect. And we shall special out. Um, I could go Rocket Tracer here. Which will give me technically two bodies. Does it negate effects? Nope. Okay, yeah, let's go Rocket Tracer. Because this can give me up to two bodies. As defense. Sure. Black metal floats, floats into darkness. It doesn't float, it just searches it. Yep, of course, of course he was able to get the draw too. Sure, dude. Cool. Battle phase. Attack. I'm gonna activate the rocket tracer. I could just pop itself. Although... Realistically, do I need Ravine? I can send another dragon. I will just pop itself. Go for Recharger. Opinions on what? Muscular women. Uh, it exists. Ravine could be useful still. Exactly. Okay, so first things first. Let's go Collapse Serpent. Banish Wiper Burster, I guess. I didn't activate this. Interesting. Well, let's go Striker Dragon. Should have made Striker and rammed into the Exo. Yeah, I could have done that. Okay, let's make another Striker. <clears throat> Pop self, add a tracer, I guess. Imperm. Wow, okay. Um, I haven't normal, have I? No. Is there anything I could send here? I could crash. 
And then I could boot sector. Bring back. No, but I need... Hmm. I could send Destrudo. Which kind of gets me into this game. Yeah, let's do this. Send Nib. Do I have an 8 in Grave? No, meaning this doesn't do anything. <sighs> so unlucky. Distruto doesn't have anything to target? Yes, it doesn't. <sighs> let's go, let's go Tracer. Let's go Distruto. And now I could go Halk. I think I kind of need to go Halk here. Instead of that. What can I end on with Halk? Hmm. Pop and bring out the no I have to I have to yeah, I can't do that. I unlocked into darks, so we gotta go with this guy. And we will special out the desk bot. <laughs> Out comes the Auroradon. Auroradon effect. Let's go one, two, three. And out comes Deskbot. So I could go Baron and I could use this to pop this guy. And then I'd have Baron. And this guy would be off the field. And I'd have a negate, and I could pop a card. Yeah, let's do that. And I get follow up off of that. I'm gonna pop this one. Draco back. Okay. All right, pass the turn. Pop the spell? The spell's not doing anything. I guess it would have been better, but... Down comes Rite of Aramisir. That's a second, right? It's not, no. Uh... Sure. Because he, ha there's no way he's playing a third Draco back. I refuse to believe that he's playing a third Draco back. Wandering Griffin, negate. Okay. Yeah, I negate the Wandering Griffin. I guess I didn't need to negate it, but. What? What's happening? What are you doing? Yeah, he's used the two right. Oh, he's adding water enchantress. Pitching an exo sister? What can he go into? He can't make another verte. What's he doing? 
Am I dead? I'm on 450 life points. Of course I'm scared. No, he literally doesn't have anything. If he had another Griffin, he's just the greatest player of all time. I'm going to summon back the Recharger here. Let's summon from Grave. Let's go... He doesn't have anything. <sighs> he had a an Exosister, and he chose not to summon it. He could have normaled the Exosister and actually had interaction on my turn that I would have had to play through. And instead, he chose not to do that. What? The guy was bad. You're fighting the strongest Exosister player on Earth? <laughs> yep, basically. Game of bricks, indeed. Luckily, I dealt with it. Yeah. Whatchamacallit? This hand is hilarious. Let's start with Chaos Space. Pitching Driver. Add. Ooh, I could add. Levy. Ooh, I could add Levianir. I think that might actually be worth it. Seeing as how the Ash Blossom didn't come down, and there's no Max C. Nine hundred and ninety-three. Uh, what do I want more to resolve? Probably Striker. The sanest one wouldn't play the deck. Me. <laughs> I built it, I've played it, and I've stopped. <laughs> yeah. To be fair, I don't think Exosisters are that bad. They're bad. Don't get me wrong, they're bad. But they're not that bad. Alright, Boot Sector. Special summon this guy. From hand. Do not use the effect. Now I could either go Christian or Halcafibrax, or I could go Romulus, and I think Romulus is the play. Go Romulus. How many darks do I have? One, two, three. Okay, good to know. So let's go Dragon Ravine. Have I normaled? I have. Okay. Let's go Dragon Ravine. Exo Sister is good against graveyard stuff. Excuse me, I am graveyard stuff. Uh, I could send Safer. What does sending Apps Router get me? Potential follow-up? Um... I could go... I could send Safer. Special out... Red Eyes, Special Back Safer, Pitch Levy, Search, a card, Link Off for nothing. So, yeah, we'll just send, I mean, Sending Safer is really good. Send Distrudo. Yeah, yeah, that's probably the play. And then, let's go Red Eyes, Darkness Metal, if you put DP in front of Exo Sisters, they mold, seethe, cope, and finally scoop. <laughs> uh, yep. Alright, now we can go Rocket Tracer. Do I have three darks? Nope, of course not. Why would I? That would make sense. 
I can go Destrudo. I could bring back Destrudo, and then go into Halk, and then I'd have three darts to rip a card out of my opponent's hand. I could also go Spheres. Or Sphere. Um... No, let's go help. <sighs> everyone molts then. <laughs> Activate skill drain. Then everyone said true. True. Okay, let's go this guy. One, two, three. Fantastic. One, two, three. Goodbye, card from hand. Uh, I guess let's make a Verte with these two. Oh, that was dumb. I was supposed to use this guy. Whoops. Whoops. Chaos space back one of these guys. Chaos space back this guy, I guess. Okay, well. Hulk of Fibrex is now just on my field. Whoops. Because I'm stupid. Because I'm a dummy dumb. I would love to mill a saber here. Mill a saber. Totally optimal Dragon Link plays, of course. Look, this deck is difficult. Uh, do I just grab the Synchron here? I think I have to grab the Rocket Synchron. Literally my only target. Uh, not bad. Terrible mills, though. I mean, I did mill a Chaos Space, so that's not terrible. But it's not great. I drew the Rite of Aramisir, so I am just the greatest player of all time. Uh... <laughs> Uh, okay. Add to hand the Wandering Griffin Rider. Sends the rocket. And I didn't activate the effect of my normal summoned monster. Cool. Fateful adventure. Uh, no, I'm just gonna add this to my hand. And then I could go... I can't really do that, can I? <sighs> Dang. Uh... I straight up rigged the deck. Exactly. I could go IP Mascarena, which honestly isn't bad here. Given the fact that I can go Nightmare Unicorn, pitch this Draco back, Draco back equip to the token, and I can just use this guy. Um, but that does take away the negate. <sighs> but it does put a very nice form of interaction onto the field. If I had another way to get this guy off of the field, that would be great. I don't, though. Oh, I guess I... Mm. <laughs> no, I don't. <laughs> Uh Alright, let's just go let's just go Verte here then. Such a this, this is so bad. This is so bad. It's fine though. Kinda locked the zones. Well I well I would have still used the wandering because I'd want to be able to equip the Draco back, to, so I'd want to keep the token. Anyway. Um, I'm going to go like this. And we're going to pop this Verte because I am so low on life. Uh, 
and then, yeah. Sorry, let me explain the other play that I was thinking of making. So I could have linked off of these two to make an IP Mask Arena, because then I could have used the IP and the Hulk to go into a, um, a Unicorn. We could have pitched this, which would have then been able to equip to the Adventure Token. Uh, so there's that. Flu wander Rees Nuts. Uh, I literally cannot allow that to resolve. So, let's do this. I refuse to believe that you play in an, an additional one. So there's that. Yeah, Formula Synchron would have been good. Map. Uh, is this a hard once per turn? You can only use each effect once per turn. Sure. I play two in my Flunder. Why are you playing two? That seems weird. That doesn't seem very good. Robina. I don't think I'm dead. Oh, I might be dead. To go second when necessary. Fair enough. I think I'm dead. Eh, maybe not. No, I think I barely live with Hulk. So there's that. Not entirely sure how I won that, but I will take it. <laughs> <laughs> that was bad. How many tokens I got? Six. Oh no. Okay. Okay. I got some more gems. Hooray. Yo, I got a legacy pack. His mom called him. The nuggets were ready. No, he was he was dead there. Um How close am I? Twelve. Not very. Okay. <laughs> no. <sighs> I could dismantle uh pink. I could dismantle Ragek wait no. Literally cannot. He forgot he didn't have an additional summon. I That may have been it. But I don't think that's what it was. I think he was thinking like... Anyway. I don't know what he was thinking. Let's be honest. I have no idea what he was going for. Alright. Let's play Ad Emancipator. With Adventure. With just the one random... Uh, water Enchantress. Why the name Snowix? Any story behind it? Yes. Uh, oddly enough, this was not a question I got asked during my Q&A, which was surprising. But the simple reason behind um, Snowix is that as I was making my name, I had a friend whose name was Heroix, spelt the same except for H, like Hero, I-Q-S, because his name started with a Q. And, uh, yeah, so I originally named myself Heroics with a K instead of a Q. And, uh, from there, I decided, like, it was too close to his and, like, it, it just got confusing. So instead, uh, what we decided, or what I decided to do was take something that I really like and then just, uh, just change the change the first part, keep the last part, because I like it. Uh, so I decided on snow, because I really like snow. Um, that was basically it. Uh, so yeah, there you go. That's my explanation. Um, What should I take out? 
Maybe I take out the prank hit engine and throw in like Cupid pitch and such. Because I can make a four. So I could throw in the the, uh, the Cupid pitch engine <sighs> with like Nemesis and all of that. Let me check out a Cupid pitch deck. Take out a Doki? That's a good option. Although Doki's a crazy good normal. Let me check out some Cupid Pitch deck lists. Let's let's look at them together. Uh let's Cupid Pitch. Adventure combo. I think this is Hold the phone. Hold up, hold up, go back, go back, go back, go back, go back. Why is it that the engines on this are Adventure, Halk, and Adventure? Why? Huh? Showing us the decks? Of course. Takatomborg and Terror Top. Interesting. So we could throw in Nemesis Corridor as well, if I wanted to. And then just play, like, Ad Emancipator stuff instead. Man, e Telly is a... Ah, uh, that card should definitely be banned. <laughs> you Psychic? No. What what Psychic are they summoning? Oh, the One Wielder. Interesting. So I could play Danglong. I could play the Yang Zing. Uh, it's Cupid Pitch... Colossus. How do you get Colossus? I'm unfamiliar. So you go into Halk. You bring out... Jet? Right? Bring out Jet. And then you go into this guy. Special summon back Jet. Oh, they are playing the one card, uh, Halk. I'm very confused. So yeah, you normal Sangan, you go into the Crusader Arborea, yada yada, yeah, that's how you do it. But then you go... Shit. Oh, oh yeah, and then you make Yazi. And then... You destroy it somehow? I guess you go... I don't remember how this deck works. How do you get this card to your hand? How in the world do you search that? You just draw it? Hope that you have it in hand? No, there's a way you search it. How do you... How do you add this card to your hand? Show that target in the deck, target one of your banished nemesis monsters, add it to your hand. I only know two helped on combos, one for ritual and the other for creation resonator. The one unsearchable card. You don't search it unless you top deck it. Cupid Pitch searches it. Thank you, that was it, yes. Increase or decrease by the level of the tuners. Uses material have on the field. Uh, this card gains attack equal to its level times 400. If this card is synchro summoned, uh, is it synchro summon card is sent to a graveyard of synchro material, inflict damage to your opponent. Uh, and then you can add a level 8 or a lower monster with 600 defense from your deck to your hand. And you add this guy which can then shuffle back one of your monsters. Yes, okay. That's how you do it. Thank you. Cupid's a rare? It was a common in, uh, in, it's a common in paper. I have like 40 of them. They're everywhere. And then, and then you make a Colossus. Uh, I don't have access to Colossus at the moment. 
but it's worth considering. So, I just don't have it. Ah. I figured since it was common, I would have had it, but no. The game said no. Uh, let me actually check. Are there other... Yo, guys, DK is live. Go watch him instead. They run Sangan in that deck? Yeah, it's a one-card Helcafibrax. What was I looking for? I was looking for... an Ad Emancipator deck list. 60-card Ad Emancipator list. You're really running a 60-card Ad Emancipator list? That seems terrible. Miracle Rupture. I... Oh, okay. Um, sure. <clears throat> Are they running Cupid Pitch? They're not. Okay. Uh, let me see if y g o p r o d e c k dot com. I would love to see Master Duel decks. Yo, Sue Ships! I need to play Sue Ships. Fluanda Rees God. Right. That seems like a great archetype. Uh. How do you spell Adamantipator? How do you spell Adamantipator? Adaman. Okay, I was right. Adaman. Unless I spelled it wrong that time. Adamantipator. When was this? July 15th. All right. All right, not looking at that one. What yikes. Natria Cliff. Okay, they're playing the water, which I don't mind. Why are you playing so many spells? What does Small World give you? With exactly one of the same type, attribute, level, attack, or defense. They're all rocks. They're all earth rocks. What do you get out of this? What? Huh? It gives you depression. Yeah, seriously. Like, what? I guess you could technically go, like, any Ad Emancipator into any other card, basically, into this guy. The hand traps for the researcher analyzer? I guess? Although, can you? Is Plague Spreader the... No. Plague Spreader's not the bridge. Is this guy the bridge? No. What's the bridge? Ad Emancipator into Plague into anything? I guess you could go into a Dark. You could go into a... Level 2? I guess you could go, like, Seeker into Plague into Researcher, which then gives you Researcher to Special. I still don't like it. This is... Yeah, what... What has 200 a defense or 400 attack? Doki Doki? No. <laughs> Save the headache and run three block dragon instead. Dude, block dragon is such a brick. All right. I, I'm sorry. I'm losing my mind what, looking at these lists. Yo, no. Naturia Beast and Fossil. Nice mix. All right. Adamantspader Synchro. Fossil Adamantspader. This is from July. I want to see, like... Adventure stuff. No one's playing the adventure stuff. I swear I've seen an adventure build for this deck. Am I am I crazy? I'm going crazy. This is 45 cards. Why are people running more cards? Another 45 card. All right, we're done. We're done here. Goodbye. <laughs> oh no. So we can go into Q 
Cupid pitch. Cupid pitch. I don't have this card. Crazy. So we can't go into Cupid pitch because it is a four, and we can make a four with Doki Doki and any of the level twos. We could even do it with Maxi and a level two. Nature a moment. <sighs> and then we can go into. What do we even go into? Because we can search this, but I don't really do anything. What do I synchro summon into with this? Is the question. I guess I could decrease its level and I can make either a 6, an 8, or a 10 with a 4. Yeah, with any 4, I can make a 6, 8, or a 10. Creation Resonator instead of Corridor to run in Savage Baron Herald. Wait, sorry, what the heck is Creation Resonator? If you control a level 8 or higher Synchro Monster, you can special summon this card from your hand. Um, that doesn't really do much for me. Not a rock, not worth. <laughs> yes. That's why. I mean... I'm trying to think... Because you're going to be making this with a 2 and a 2. And it's going to be either a a level 2, a level 6. Yeah, a level 2 or a level 6. Uh, so I can either make a... I can make a 6, I can make an 8, and I can make a, uh, a 10 with it. But the number for creation resonator doesn't line up the reason you would play nemesis corridor is because if you banish anything which you do banish in this deck thanks to block dragon you can shuffle one of those monsters back special this guy and then go into a what should we call it i don't have the card though so there's that <sighs> maybe i just take that out for now and just don't play it hmm Make it five. How do you make Cupid a five in this deck? Oh, you make it with the uh, the level one. We're not we're not playing a level one. I guess I could throw in Jet, or I could throw in Deskbot. Make a cubit of five, send two tokens for Colt Wing. Cupid alters its level on its own. Yes. But what I was saying is the reason we would play Cupid Pitch is because we can already make it off of the Ad Emancipators and the Doki Doki. Or another two, like Maxine. So you make it with these two. That's what I was going to make it with was an Ad Emancipator and a Doki Doki. So it would be an even number, because the even numbers are easier for the Ad Emancipator stuff. If that makes sense. That's why, I, that's why I was so confused as to why you were like, play this odd number card to go into Baron. I'm like, what? That doesn't work. Yes, I could play Coltwing. Yes, I could play Deskbots and other such cards. I don't really want to add more bricks to an Adam Spader deck because you need to see more rocks. And none of the Adam or none of the none of these are rocks. So Yeah, it's a hard brick as well. Yeah, Coltwing is you have to summon it from deck, which is another issue. And we're already playing a few Ricky cards, so it's not really worth it to include those. Whereas, like, if I go Cupid Pitch and I make the four, and then I search out 
like I make it a six or something like that. I can still summon out a Baron with it, um, but I also get to search out the Nemesis Corridor and then I can go for the Nemesis Corridor. There's no back seating. Yeah, no new. No, yeah, with Arcanites, no one knew what was going on. So no back seating. Fair enough. Um. Well, let's take out the the stuff. We'll keep this because it, it it is pretty nice to have. And then. I mean, the 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 last card is the Colossus. How do you spell Colossus? Oh, it's one L. It's one L, two S's. What's up, Vectra? How's it going? So I guess this is what we'll build towards. I think we just need to like include the Cupid Pitch uh, to search out Nemesis Corridor. It doesn't really do anything else. It's just like, it just adds a little bit more. Um, and it's another four that we can go to. I often find that I need, uh, like, I want another four. Ha going into Herald, mm, sorry, going into Herald is always nice. Um, but it's better to have a little bit more extension than the extra negate. And being able to go into, like, Thunder Dragon Colossus is absolutely crazy. Why is this card not banned, by the way? Uh, I could also go, like, Scythe and do Scythe stuff instead. Like, I take out, I take out these two, I take out this, I put in Dagda, and I put in... Um, are those three honest used in anything? Uh, no. However, can't dismantle them. Reason being, they are they were obtained through one of the structure decks, so I just can't use them. I would love to dismantle that. Are you kidding me? That'd be amazing. Oh yeah, there are so many cards. Like this card, Dual Assem Assemblerm. Awesome card. Awesome card. Love it. Uh, anyway, for now, we'll take out these and I'll throw in the Scythe and the Dagda. And I think I have TG Wonder Magician. So we can throw these in. We can play with Scythe. And see what it does. Uh, what do I want to take out, though? Probably Cupid Pitch, if we're going to be running this. All right. I got to go to the bathroom. We'll be right back. Have I seen Dark Side of Dimension? Is that the, uh, the Yu-Gi-Oh? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, I have. I'll be right back. Gotta go to the bathroom and then we'll play some Scythe Block out of Emancipators, baby. He forgot the scythe? Did I? Did I? No, I didn't. Hmm. 
Was Dark Side of Dimension good in my opinion? Yeah, it was fine. It wasn't, I mean, it was a Yu-Gi-Oh movie, so it wasn't like exceptional, but it was pretty fun. I liked it, yeah. Wow, this hand is tragic. Luckily, I'm going second, so it's not that bad. <laughs> they introduced Cubics in that movie? True, they did. Inspector Mother Trucking Border. So cool, dude. So based. <sighs> Neither player can activate monsters unless the number of monster effects that player has previously activated that turn is less than the number of monster card types currently on the field. So I can't activate anything, right? That's like the whole thing. <sighs> so if I normal this, I don't get activate researcher. Warning. You're fantastic. Set one, set two, pass. Why does it have 2k? Because uh, Konami is terrible at card design. Have we not figured this out? What, the actual F? Okay, cool. Um, let's banish a... <sighs> Ash Blossom. I should have just set this one. That would have been better. Okay. Setting the water egg walls in. True. Cool, another called by. All right, well, set, pass. Dude, are you having fun? Are we having fun now? I hope we're having fun, dude. Oh cool, dude. I love drawing my seat. Is this it? This is the plan? This is the this is the plan. Uh what can I go into? Can I Can I go into anything? Does anything deal with this? Not particularly, no. Order sounds really boring. Oh, it is. I could go. I could. I. Okay. Normal maxi. Make. Hulk. And then I should be able to activate something. I should be able to activate the Hulk at the very least. Strike. Cool. Fantastic. Love it. 10 out of 10, dude. So cool. So based. So interesting. So unique. So fun. So cool. I'm gonna kill you. That was so fun. Wow. I feel like Inspector Border and Kaiser Coliseum need to be banned. Not necessarily because they are inherently overpowered or annoying or anything like that, but just because I don't want to have to read that every time because I have no idea what it is. Like, how does this even work? Every time I see Inspector Border come down, I'm like, okay, now how does this work again? Every time. Same with, uh... Same with, um... 
what is it? Kaiser Colosseum. I have to read that card every time. I'm like, okay, hold on. I know I can't do certain things, but I can do something. What is it that I can't do? <laughs> Border is legit a resonant sleeper card. True. Ash Blossom. Depression. Depression. Might as well tuck me into bed. I'm napping. True. All right. Normal Analyzer. I, I mean, activate the effect. Search out Draco back. Nope. I always like having cards to discard. That's always nice. Out comes Seeker. Hey, yo, Doki Doki. Fantastic. <clears throat> I can make Baron. F it, Doki Doki first. Summon number five. What are you going to do? Im uh, Nibiru me? Please don't. I will cry. Actually, you know what? Now you can't. Now you can't. Fantastic. Uh, and now we make this one. I'd rather play against Flunder any day of the week than Border. I'd rather play against Border. Because that deck is so bad. <clears throat> Flunderies, it, it's not up to you whether you win or lose. It's up to the opponent. Special. Your boy. And now we make... A Link to... In Christron, Health Fib Frex. Christron, Health Fib Frex. Special Token Generator Machine. Activate Researcher. Oh, there's another Guardian. Oh, there's Supplier. I guess I could. I, I just go Guardian here, right? Two guardians. Uh, and then I can go. No, I can't go down granite yet. I could go union carrier with these two, and then I get a token. It's a weird token, but uh. Yeah, let's do that. Apollosa. Guardians in the pen column. The pen summon. Okay, and then we go this guy. Supplier, aka the plug. Exactly. <clears throat> do, 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 do. Ooh. There's food for me. Alright. Let's just get this rank up and then I'll call it. <clears throat> I saw a meme. The other day about Yu-Gi-Oh, and then uh, sorry, the meme was stop the adventure engine. Like, oh, I use a hand trap to stop the adventure engine, and then they combo off with their main deck or like their actual deck. And I was just like, yeah, that's exactly what just happened. Anyway, what was that guy even using? Don't know. Don't care. Probably blue eyes. Let's be honest. I'll probably go eat dinner, and then I'll come back and stream, because I really want to play Arknights, so why not show us the meme? All right. Well, this guy's taking his turn, since I have literally nothing I can do. I'm just going to let this guy go. I shall show you slay meme. Uh, now I'm bad, and it's just on Duel Links meta meme review because of course uh where was it where was it oh here we go 
Opponent opens Enchantress slash right, going first. I interrupt his play. He starts comboing off with the deck's main archetype. It's a good one. I mean, we can look at all of these. Me, a rogue player, every time a new engine drops. Welcome to the team, bro. Yeah, that sounds about right. How it feels to play against Flunder. This one's hilarious. Penguin just launches, blows up the guy in the water that he already fell into. Ah, oh, so cool. Sometimes memes are funny. That's a minus two meme. Look, some memes are funny, like the Flunder one. It's not too funny, but it's kind of funny. And sometimes they're really bad. It was just, it was something I remembered. Should I have remembered it? No, because it was dumb. Set five pass, please. I don't play uh, Harpies. Why do I not play Harpies? Because I don't want to go, I don't want to go second. You think I'm going to play a going second card at all in this deck? If I go second, I just like scoop. I'm like, okay, all right, good game. What is my opponent? How, how did this come to be? How did we end on Leela Pass? What? I drew Maxi. I drew Maxi for. All right. Do I just special the Wandering Griffin Rider? I mean, sure, why not? It's extra damage. Maximum C. Your comments aren't funny. That's why I don't read them. Well, I do read them. I just don't care, so I don't respond to them. Where's? There it is. It's like, where's my Maxi? I know I have one. Lancia. A oh, piss off. Cool. Cool. I guess we're just specialing Wandering Griffin Rider and attacking. Oh. I guess I could normal this guy as well. Yeah, let's do it. Ow. I mean, I'll activate my own Maxi, <clears throat> since you didn't allow me to negate it. Oh cool, Ash Blossom. What is this? If this card is special, someone in you control a Lilo, you could draw a card during your main phase. If you do not control a Lilo monster, you can special summon a Lilo. Yeah, I'll stop that. Sure, why not? Anything I could go into. I'm going to Dagda. Which doesn't really do anything. Uh, yep, just passing the turn. Thank you for telling about Flander. Now I know what to do. Evil Twin isn't even <laughs> that evil. True. Oh, I think I just lose the access code now. So cool. So based. So fun. So... Evil! Evil! Leela, whoa. It's okay. It's okay, guys, I got this. Dude, I love Maxi so much. Such a cool and based card.
I hate you. I hate you and the fact that you only become a dragon. It should be the other way around. You should be a dragon all the time, except for in the battle phase. Then you can be a cute anime wife. I don't care. Gah! Life Twins are just... They don't do anything. Like, wouldn't it have just been better to just go access code there instead of doing this? Wouldn't more damage have been done? I don't know. I don't really care either. No, my card! Wait, now I just special this guy. Lol. You gonna ash me? Do it, punk. I dare you. Please don't. I'll cry. <sighs> you gonna called by me? Droplets. Well, it's a good thing I put it in defense. <clears throat> and now they just stare at me and go, "All right, I, I don't, I don't know what to do." Well, battle phase is over. No, she's back! No! I like how the teasers that we got for this was just the dragon. And then they give us this. It's like, alright, well, whatever. Ending on this. Cool, fantastic. Love to see it. I drew another mother trucking researcher. Dude, how does it feel? I'm just the greatest duelist of all time. What are you going to do? Destroy a card on the field? I dare you. I double dog. Dare you. Actually, don't. I'll cry. I'll be very sad. Dude, I love this. It's so fun. So fun. Imperm. Impermanization. Dooby dooby dooba. Be dooba. Ba dooba. I could just go Hulk here. Thinking. I could do this, but then I get popped. So there's no point in doing that. I could do this. And I don't get popped. Yeah, let's go Christron. Let's go Christron, Hulk, and Fibrex. Christron, Hulk, and Fibrex. Stop laughing. I'll come to your house. I'll find you. Well, that's why they're evil twins, James. Because they're not twins. At all. Alright, let's special out... I guess this guy. Yeah. Whoa, burn damage. Good night, Rin. Thanks for stopping by. No, my Hulk. No, you get a draw card. Oh, uh, yep. Go IP Mask Arena. Go Dagda. Uh, none of these options are good. Alright, let's go Dagda. <sighs> I 
could go unicorn. Doesn't do any. I I don't care, dude. Like, yeah, cool, dude. You got it. Yeah, dude. You're super dope. Wow, live twin. Whoa, so cool. So. And with that, mate. And with that, mate. Yikes, dude. Mega cringe. Thought I was gonna go get food. I said we're gonna get a rank up and then I'm gonna go get food. Have I ranked up? I love going second with these amazing going first hand. I gotta go first. <sighs> and I draw a hand like this. Yikes. Yeah, I'm probably not going to wait till I rank up. I I only had the two wins, and then I got immediate two losses because Konami said, F you, we don't like you. We hate you. And to that I say, I resent you. I resent that. Oh, there's Guardian. There's Guardian. And another Doki Doki. Do 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 do. Do 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 do. Do 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 do. Supplier! And a whole bunch of adventure cards. I guess I'm getting supplier. Yikes. Missed the Dragon Link stream? It, yeah, basically. <laughs> you missed the Dragon Link half of this stream. Sorry, mate. Uh, let's go... Halk? With these two? Were I... Was I Halk donning? Of course. It's Dragon Link. You think I'm not gonna do that? Let's special from hand the Mecha Fan of Beast O-Line. Alright, now let's go for what do I have engraved? Nothing. I guess I go Apo? Apo kind of doesn't do anything, does it? I need an extension. I need an extender. I guess I, I should have just gone Gallant Granite. That would have been better. I guess let's go... I guess I could go Dagda. I could just go... Hmm. I could go Dagda with these two. And then I could go... Or I could go IP with these two. And then I could go into Union Carrier. And I... Mm, it's not really great. My opponent has disconnected. I want Heavy Storm at one and Feather Duster banned. <laughs> Saying Heavy Storm for six is way better. <laughs> Of course. All right, let's do one more win or loss, and then I'll end the stream, and uh, I'll be back in a little with some Arknights, because I want to play Arknights. Um, and I might as well stream it, because, you know, why not? <clears throat> it's fun. Going second! What? 
<sighs> and it's with this guy. Gross. This hand is actually not bad. It's not great, but it's not bad. Ban Halkdon and Ben 10 to 2. I'm sorry, what? Ben 10 to 2? Ben 10 should just be banned. It's not that I don't like Drytron. I I don't care as much about Drytron, like, genuinely. But Ben 10 is not a good card. It's a it's a poorly designed card. Is this a 60 card? I have no idea what's going on. Might be Zephyr Pile? Probably. What was the... What? Add an Endymion card? What What Endymion card did they add? Did we... Oh, look. Endymion. Right. I have Effect Veiler for their... For their, um... What should we call it? Special summon both this card and your pendulum from your pendulum zone and a monster from your deck. Ah, yes. Why do these get counters? What? Each time a spell card is activated, place two once per turn. When an opponent's monster activates an effect, you can remove two spell counters from the field, negate the activation, and destroy that card. Um... This counts as a spell activation. <sighs> Servant gives counters. Oh, it gives counters. Okay. Uh, I think I have to negate this, but I, I, I don't want to negate that. That seems so bad. Because then he just goes Electromite. Yeah, sure. If only it was an imperm. True. True. Reflector. Sure. 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 Salt mode beast. It's the beastie boy. What do they even make here? Like, I'm genuinely curious. What do they go for? It's just Halk? I mean, it says, let's hope it's Halka Fibrax. If it's Halka Fibrax. I mean, it probably is, let's be honest with ourselves. Boralode? Like, oh, Boralode Savage. They made a nine. Oh, sorry, this is six. Oh, do they go Power Tool? That would make sense. Shooting Riser. Ah. I see. Sure. Nah, Boralode Fusion. Ah, I see. Send Snow. I mean... Valor. I knew I should have Valored this one. Just, just Valor it. Just get the tokens off of it, or the uh, counters off of it. It's not like I could have done anything else. If the tokens get up, or the counters, counters get up. I might be able to do something here. Hmm. <clears throat> 
They have snow, though, which kills me. If they activate snow, I'm dead. Look at my cool rogue deck. Look at cool Endymion, dude. So cool. I love Endymion. Dude, pendulums are so fun. Yo, dang. Alright, that one doesn't count. I refuse to end on that. I refuse to end on that. That was bull. <clears throat> oh, cool! It's Pot of Greed! What do you mean, let them play? They literally just do the Hauk Dawn Dang Long stuff. That everyone is doing. Go look up any video about Kenny Hauk Dawn combo stuff. It's the same thing. Weird thing to add it to Endymion. They have uh, access to a tuner. This hand is amazing going second. Holy crap. Mo yay. Mm -hmm. Reveal the tie off. I have to stop this. Red Mother Trucking Reboot. I can't activate anything in response. Cool. Fantastic, dude. I don't even have another trap to set. I, like, literally, that's it. I have the one mother effing in there. Who plays Reboot? This guy, apparently. Ooh, Guardian. <sighs> and Dominions don't have access naturally unless he plays... Yeah, did Cyber Focus specifically for Hulk? Well, yeah, but like, what other cards are you going to play other than the Hulk stuff? Right? Oh, sick. I can now go Analyzer, Normal, Myru, Special Researcher. Oh my gosh, that's crazy. No, my card that was gonna be negated anyway. Oh, piss off. I hate you, game. Ooh, doki doki. I hate when people do this, when they put their token in attack. It's like, dude, just put it in defense. No one cares. It's not good for your health. He may be a chatter or a fool. He's a fool. I'm going to activate Ash Blossom here. I'm going to activate Nibiru here. Cool. That stops their Baron. Draws another Nib. He's got one Negate. One spell and trap card negate. 
one Omni. Well, would you look at that? He drew the out. Maximum Mother Trucking C. All right. Do I have an out to this? At least no more negates. He doesn't shuffle it back? What? That's just dumb. Oh, so fun. So fun. Okay. What can I go for easily? That doesn't draw him like a million guards. Do I just try and kill him? Do I just say, all right, you took the maxi challenge, I'll take the maxi challenge, except I get to go second, and you have half as many life points. I'm just going to try and kill him. Alrighty. Let's go researcher. Let's go analyzer. <clears throat> Phoenix, I just let it happen. Doki Doki. Yep. Out comes Doki Doki. Activate the Doki Doki, pitch you. Go for a Seeker. <sighs> hmm. Might as well just go this guy. And Emancipator is a deck, I guess. True. Sure. Not the negate you should have gone for, but okay. Water Enchantress. Supplier! Supplier! Supplier. Add Supplier. Let's go for... Let's go for this one. Oh wait, I haven't used your effect. Okay. Um... Let's go Hulk, I guess. Hulk's always good. I beat Adam Spader with tunes once. That's nice. Do I care about that? Uh, actually, no, that's fine. Rap type. 
I made a sick YouTube video about it. Nice. Oh, there's Block Giant. Oh, Guardian and Researcher. Ooh. Uh, let's go... Oh, sorry. Did I say Guardian? I meant Supplier. Let's go Supplier here. Save for Nib? Of course. Alright, let's go Seeker. What did he use to negate Nib? Uh, the Baron. Um, let's go drag out myself. I still can use right of Aramis here. Oh, I didn't know that. Really? Nothing. Nothing. Fantastic. Awesome. Love to see it. Well, then, let's just go... Yikes. Let's go Baron. Battle Fader incoming? Oh dear. That would suck. There's the nib. Uh, let's use this one. Kawaki Myru Guardian. No nib. Oh, because I normaled that guy. Okay, that's why I could still use the Rite of Aramis here. Um... I could go unicorn and spin something away. I could go access code. Shoot. Shoot, I forgot. I needed that card. Whoops. Wasn't paying attention. <sighs> access isn't lethal now. Oh, I guess now it is. Yeah, now I can go access, and it's lethal. Had I kept the Guardian and instead used the Baron, I could have gone for a Gallant Granite, which was what I was thinking to do. I... This is why you don't take the Maxi Challenge. Oh yeah, he didn't have anything else. I guess he could have had Imperm, which does stop me. Um, so there's that. Yeah, that was that was dumb. I I could have had that easier, but yeah. That guy's hand was cracked though. He had freaking everything. He cut imperm for red reboot. No, he had to. He had two imperms. See you in an hour. Yeah. Uh, I'll be. Yeah, I'm gonna end the stream there. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you did indeed enjoy it, like is very much so appreciated. And if you want to check out more content like this as well as more Yu-Gi-Oh, then just be sure to subscribe. Anyway, thank you guys so much for watching, and remember to always stay frost. Stay frosty. Bye bye.